Hello and welcome to No Man's Sky, everybody. Lon Paul here, and this is a dead stream. Dead stream is the opposite of a live stream in the sense that I know I'm not live on the air today, but we're doing a dead stream in the sense that we're going to do this as kind of an official slash unofficial speed run of the Omega Expedition. Now, uh, I think the record is currently like 53 minutes or 52 minutes or something like that, some ridiculously low time. Um, I've been learning a lot watching some of the other streams and stuff like that, and I've been changing some stuff up. And I am that kind of person, as some of you are or are not aware, who takes a lot of notes on stuff. So I've got lots of notes, like this one right here. It's The green screen is going to affect some stuff, um, which is basically all the phases put together and what they do and everything like that, all the prizes, pardon me, rewards that you get from the milestones. And then I put together another several page thing here here it is multiple pages um on going through it and then what i do is i go through the stream and i practice it check it out or probably not the stream go through the <laughs> the expedition and try it out and to see what i can do with this and a lot of times i'll go in here and i'll mark things out and I'll do this do this do that don't forget to do this so i've got a couple interesting things that i do that's a little different and yet I'm going to also copy some things at the same time. So we're going to try to get this done. We're going to try to get it done in a decent amount of time. So let's pull it in here real quick. You see, I've already got the timer all the way there, that way. i got to remember which way it's going to show on the screen. All the way over there. My unofficial time is one hour. My official time is one hour, one minute. I want to get this below an hour. I mean, I don't care if it's 59 minutes. If I can shave one minute off this time, I will be so ecstatic on that. Just getting in under the hour mark would be fantastic. I'll be really looking forward to that. So we're going to be giving this a shot today. Uh, let me just turn up my regular game volume a little bit on my speaker so I can hear things. So it says three weeks remaining. we got plenty of time on this. So I've been really working on some stuff. So I do a couple, like I said, I do some things differently. A lot of guys, they get their ferrite dust, they scan their plants. I do scan my plants at the very beginning. I have to get all three buried items on that starter planet. That has to happen. I have been having a lot of trouble with the base computer. Um, I think I might have figured out a fix. I think what's been happening is I've been putting the base computer, literally jumping out of the ship and putting the base computer right down in front of me. I think my ship is too close to it to allow the milestone to trigger. I don't know why, but I picked it up and I moved it further away and dropped it and all of a sudden it triggered within about 15 seconds. So did it do it? I don't know. I guess we're going to find out here. I haven't played it at all today. So I've been finding that it works better on a fresh start. That is freshly opening up the game and starting it. So we'll see how this goes. Not sure, but we'll see. All right. Just getting ready. I'll probably hit my water every now and then. And it should be starting up any time. We should get that nice white screen. There it is. Ugh. Yeah, at night, that's a real pain, let me tell you. And we start our timer. So as a reminder to those who've never seen anybody do a speed run on this before, the timer is a representation of real time, of course, for us, but not game time. Anytime you're in hyperspace, um, uh, I think pretty much hyperspace about the only thing, and the escape menu. When you go into the escape menu to check out the expedition to pull in the milestone rewards, then you have, then it will pause the in-game time now as it starts up i always look around i want to see what i can see i see some animals flitting around but i'm not seeing the ground unfortunately it doesn't help me at all so i know my ship is over in this direction here i got plants but i don't have anything else that i can see but we're going to go with whatever we got here hopefully we'll get a nice run out of this we should be starting in a second now i'm going to scan first and it looks like we got some buried stuff right next to me. That's not going to help any. Let me grab you, your plant. That's two. Is that a plant? Three. Good. Uh, we already got you guys. Whoop, what's that? Plant four. Good. And let's move somewhere else real quick here. We already got you guys. Those. That's a new one. Five. And then the one right below it. Right there. Six. Okay, so we got the six plants. That's done. And because the ship is this way, I want to look around. We should have buried cash right there, 100 points away. We do want to find heptaloid wheat, which is right there. Okay, good. I know this run. I know this area. And get rid of the things that are coming up on the screen. I used to go into first-person mode. If it's not working, I'm just going to go ahead. Oh, good. I can pick it up right away. So that's one. Um, 
Animals we will scan along the way. That's another one. Two. I need at least eight animals. Three. Oh, that's an inorganic object. That's not going to help me any. I don't care about the money I'm getting from it. It's not important. As important to me as it is to others. So that's the fourth animal. We got some dihydrogen. We're going to get that heptaloid wheat in a minute. We need dihydrogen. We need about a hundred. more we can get, the better, of course. But anything over a hundred is exactly what we're looking for. You hope for a crystal out of it. And we're obviously going to need some... Carbon. Oh, good, we got a crystal. There's one. Is that 50 carbon? Good. Ah! I didn't mean to do that. I should have been paying attention. We're up to over 100. Let's see what we get out of this now. That's uh, another 60. I want about 200 carbon just to start with. And boom. That should get us there. Yeah, good. Okay. And the heptaloid weed should be right there. Okay, good. Whoops. Take a bounce. There it is. We need that. And again, we'll need... Ooh, it's got a crystal right near it, too. That's good. Right there. Actually, I think we can get it right from here. Okay, that's two. Two buried things. And we need one more buried thing, and then we're done. Uh, buried cache, 326. A little further away than I want, but that's okay. We'll we'll go ahead and highlight it and then head over to the ship. Three and a half minutes in. There we are. Is that a animal I've scanned? It ha is. Oh, let's get you. That should be the fifth animal. I think that's... Yep, fifth. Okay, that's six. We need two more. We should have that, uh... Yeah, we'll get it in a minute. So we need two more animals. Let's go ahead and put down our refiner real quick. And this is what's going to get us our ferrite. I'm getting less and less of that stuff. And... This one we have to actually dig down just a little bit. Okay, we'll grab that. Let's get this going. So we're going to put our carbon in there. Yeah, we don't do anything with that, I'm sorry. 50, that'll give us 100 ferrite, so we're in good shape there. All right, oh, another animal. That's going to be 7. Probably the same one as up there. We can get the big, big flappy bird. There he is. That's 8. We don't need any more animals now. We'll need 12 all total to get the achievement, but that's okay. We should get four on the next planet, but I'm not going to worry about it at this point. We need oxygen, so let's grab that. And where is that buried technology? There it is. Buried cash, my bad. Oh, we want to pick up sodium as we go. I'll do a quick scan while I'm waiting. Ooh. Ooh. Condensed carbon is a big thing. We need a lot of that. Uh, I'm on manipulator. I don't want to destroy it. There we go. I've had that happen to me a couple of times. Be accidentally on manipulator and destroy the condensed carbon rather than picking it up. Okay, good. I know this particular area, so we should be able to pick that up. There we go. That's three. Good. Should be some more condensed carbon near here. The hydrogen. We are in good shape. Let's go ahead and grab it. Ah, look at that heptaloid weed right in front of me. We do need a lot of this. I'm going to grab it. We're probably going to get some at the space station as well. We can get some at the pirate station, so that's good, but we don't necessarily need it. There's some oxygen there I'm going to grab. Ouch, that hurt. Grab my ankles, that little punk. There we go. That should be good. And where's our ship at? Should be that way. There it is. Really need some more sodium if we can find it, but I don't think we're going to find any here. All right. We can do without it. It's not going to be easy, but we'll do without it if I can get going. So six and a half minutes in. Oh, did we get anything out of there? I don't know why we're having a delay here. That's really strange. 
I think I got it already. Okay, yes, that was the Corvax casing. Okay, and what we're going to do is grab this, half it. This goes into my inventory, start that up. While we're waiting, we're going to put this over there, this over there, and we're going to drop in and make a metal plate and a dihydrogen jelly. While we're waiting, let's just go ahead and open that up, that up, get that and that. We'll get some nanites and stuff like that out of it. We are done and ready to get out of here. Okay, so we want to go in here and repair. And this would be the fastest time I've gotten off the planet, so I know a lot of guys get off of it like five, six minutes. Okay, and off we go. I always like first person view if I can do it. But here's the thing. Ooh, wow, I got the planets right in front of me. That's fantastic. So we're going to head to this planet first. Now, I know a lot of guys like to make their base on the, on the cold planet here, but you really don't need to do that because they like to get that ancient burial thing there that can cut apart. Don't worry about it. Go to the hot planet. You have, they have ancient bones there. Digging those up will give you that. So while we're doing this, let's see what we can repair. We can't repair, repair too, too much. But we can repair a couple things on each. And then move some stuff around. We're going to move the rockets down here. Shield. And we're going to put you here. And I'm going to put you here this time. Multi-tool. We can repair one thing, I think. Oh, two things. We can get that with the dihydrogen. And this. And we need to jump out. Switch. And we're going to make this. We're going to put our power to our engines. It should switch over in a second. And we just got the... In, you know, little message there to indicate that we're at there we go I took a picture and we're done and in case you're wondering if it worked or not you can go into your expedition and go over here is it see it's got one picture taken so we're out of here back up and out of the atmosphere we go and we're gonna take a quick pulse away from this there we go stop now we're going to head to the low atmosphere planet, which is this brown one over here. And we're going to do the same thing. While we're waiting, let's move some stuff around, shall we? The bolt caster is going to be very handy in just a little bit. We're actually going to go ahead and battle. Exosuit, let's move some stuff around, get our shields going. Uh, this goes here, this goes here, this goes here. Okay, we're all set. Let's get our rewards. One man's treasure gives us a whole bunch of navigation data and stuff like that. We'll need that in a little bit. Uh, we're going to go back to this one and get our exobotany one, which is the life support upgrade that we're looking for. I know that we're passing by asteroid fields. I'm doing that purposely. Let me go ahead and grab that and put that in here. We might need it later, so that's why I'm putting it in. We don't need that. We do need that. We're not going to need that. Okay. Yeah, yes, yes, I know about upgrades. All right, same thing. As soon as you get the bleep bleep and you get the thing at the top left, you can stop and take your picture. And you can get right back out of the atmosphere. And our next stop is this planet. Except we're not actually going to go to the planet yet. We're going to hit the space station. I don't know why it was taking forever to do that. Now... When you get to the space station, when you're facing the entrance of the face space station, you're looking in. If you go to the left and a little bit below it, there's an asteroid field there. So that's usually the asteroid field that I hit. So we're looking at ten and a half minutes so far. We're really way ahead of schedule than what I'm used to. I'm trying to decide if I can hit the asteroid field first or next. I may hit it next. I don't know. We'll see. You notice there's no pulse lines. I do have a mod to get rid of pulse lines. There is the space station. I just saw it. Right there. Because we haven't landed on a planet, for some reason it will not show up. And we need to get to the entrance first to orient, our, or orient ourselves. Oh, there it is. Actually, I don't need to. Just found it. All right, let's see what we can do. The small ones are easier to, to blow up. The large ones are harder, but they give you more stuff out of them. Jason, I think, has mentioned that below before as well. And you get a depth perception issue, because sometimes you don't know how, how close some of these rocks really are. Try not to shoot the space station, by the way. That can cause you a little bit of problems. Oh, okay, great. I'm gonna, I thought I was going to run into that guy. 
Because you're not sure how far away these rocks are from your ship. I try to switch to the rockets as I start to overheat a little bit. I could just stop for a few extra seconds and do it, but I really want this me to do that. And the bigger ones I like to take out with the rockets. Remember, if they're really close to you, though, splash damage, you could get that damage to your ship. See? And you go a few seconds without hitting anything. I've overheated again. Careful. Facing the space station there could send people out to attack me if I hit it. Any time now, we should be getting a uh, message. There it is. Okay, let's go to the space station. There we go. Okay, oh, there's another one right down there, too. What do you know? So, I actually had two asteroid fields right close next to each other. So, let's get in here. I'm going to drop this in there. We're going to go ahead and get our... Stuff going. We got a hundred silver out of that too. That's handy. All right, we got a good amount of stuff to sell. Let's go ahead and sell it, and we're going to get some words while we're here. We need one, nine words total from everybody here. One, two. We're at the space station at thirteen minutes. Not bad. I'm usually here about the sixteen-minute mark. So this is three right here. We should have ships landing any second now. That's four. Uh, not you. Not you. I think one passed me. This is five. Okay, this will be six. Okay, that'll be seven. One's a Gek. There should be one guy over here. Okay, so this is eight, the sales Gek. We have one more guy to get. And since we're here, unless it's one of these guys standing right next to me... Oh, there you are. Nine. Hard to find that last one. So that gets me at the 14-minute mark. Excellent. Okay, so we got nine words. We're going to sell all but one of those... Uh, let's see. The Corvax casing can go. Oh, the geodo geodesite can go. And we're going to keep the navigation data. We're going to go in here. We're going to purchase one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Actually, I'm going to get a sixth one just in case. And everything here needs to be purchased. And that will get us where we need to go. So the other things we need, we need ionized cobalt. We need, and there's nobody here, Pugnium and Salt. Now, the Salt we're going to get later, so I'm not really worried about that. As long as we can remember to do our um, Nautilus, Nautilon on the first planet, we'll have our Salt ready for us to use when we disassemble it. So I need to buy, and I'm going to get, if I can get there, there we go. We need 100 Pugnium. There we go. That should be good. There's nothing else in there I need. Okay, and by now, other ships have arrived. Okay, we'll check out the other ships. Again, ionized cobalt is one of the things I need. I can get it elsewhere, but if I can get it now, it would be easier. And I need to use my navigation data. I almost forgot that. Good grief. He does not have it. No. Anybody else land yet? Okay, I do need to hit the navigation, a cartographer, so almost forgot to do this. It would have been a waste. Because I do something special that none of the other guys do. I can get this guy to shut up just long enough for me to get. I'm going to go for these planetary charts. All five of them I'm going to use up. And that's going to give me the... Um, I'm looking for a trading post is what I'm looking for. Okay, we're not getting any ships here. We're going to leave. We've taken enough time. So we'll have to get other stuff later on. We're looking for a trading post. So I'm going to go ahead and drop down here. I don't know what is there, if that's a trading post or what that is. I'm going to go ahead and head down... This planet is chock full of stuff. And by the way, as soon as we get the notification, I'm going to take the third picture. There we go. Grand tour done. And that was proof, by the way. 
And then we're going to go in here, and I'm going to move these over because it's annoying having them here. Put them in my starship where they're more useful. Okay. Looks like it found a minor settlement. That's not going to help me. Wrong button. Let's see. What did it find this time? Looks like it found that. Whatever that is. That's why I got five of these. That's a shelter it found. It found what? Ah, that. Trading post. A uh, minute and a half away. Good. So, I know this looks like it's a waste of time, but there's something we do at the trading post. If I can get my mouse to respond. There we go. Okay. It's going to make me take the long way. That's okay. It's pretty close. Okay. Because other pilots land there, and if we land on the ground below it, we have access to five people landing at, the, at, at one time. I think I've been to this one. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do something a little different today. We're going to land our ship, but I'm going to move further away to plant my computer down. Over here. Okay, we need to get that first. Okay, we got our computer. Let me just see, was there another reward? There is. There's Stardust, which we do need that. And what's this one? Grand Tour, and we need that too. Okay, let's let it go. All right, we're going to go into our build menu. Let's place our base computer down, which is much further away than our ship, and let's see if this helps any. Now the traders land, and we're going to go ahead and check their inventory out real quick. And if we can get 200 Cactus and 200 Fungal Mode, which they usually have, we don't have to stop at either one of those two planets at all. Okay, let me go ahead and install something real quick. We need to install this in our ship, or else we run into problems. And can we upgrade that? No, we can't fix that yet. We can fix this, though. So we're going to put this over here. All right. Anything else? Scanner module? No, no. And we do need the optical drill, because we do use it from time to time. Let's put some that in there, and we're ready to go. Did it get it yet? I don't know. We're going to find out. While we're waiting... You, your, your backpack boosters are just enough to usually get right there. And that's as far as you can go. So, ships will come. There is stuff in here that you can get. I think it's, uh... Hold on, I know this. Herm hermetic seals, you need two of those. You might as well grab them while you're here. You don't really need the rest of this, so don't bother with spending or wasting your money on it. See? And they're really, it's almost constant pilots landing here. So go ahead and take advantage of it. And it looks like my computer is not doing what I wanted it to do. So we may have some problems here. Uh, let's see what he has. He doesn't have what we're looking for. By now, more pilots should be landing, as stated. See? Got two different types of pilots here. It's a pretty cool ship, too. It's green, by the way. Okay, what do you got for me, pal? He has Frost Crystal. That's not going to help me, obviously. There we go. It looks like we got another pilot up there on the upper deck. And Fecium. We need that. We're going to get all 109 of it. It should get us about 30, I think it is. Oh, wow. You saw he had just landed, though, right? Okay, that was weird. All right, so we have the Fecium, and we can put that down. Actually, I think we can do it right now, can't we? Let's put down the Fecium in here right now and do this. And get the Mordite going. We only need 25, but I'll let it play out. I really thought they'd be landing better now. Okay, while we're here, let's take a look around. Is there any animals? We do have that over there. I can't, for some reason, select it. Natural burial site over there. And we're going to fight sentinels here too, by the way. Odd, I know. I usually wait until the fifth place. But I'm going to do that here. Alright, someone just took off, not landed. So these guys should be coming in. Alright, we got a hauler coming in. Um, I'm going to go ahead and pick that up for now. Oh, two of them. Alright, we'll get you first because you just landed. Get over here. Don't walk away from me, my friend. All right, Frost Crystal and Gamma Root, neither one we need. 
And usually if you if you figure out which ship has what, those are the ships that'll have everything. We're not having a lot of luck here. A uh, fighter here. Let's see. He's a different fighter. Let's see what he's got. Cactus flesh. Okay, so we got our first thing. 130, so we need 70 more of that. And don't be surprised if some of the ones that don't usually carry it suddenly carry it either. So I check everybody. PCM. Yep, we don't need that. Can we get up there fast enough to see him if I don't quit bumping into everything? I'm usually much better than that. Uh, no. He doesn't have what we need. Alright. And he's still there. Let's go to the other platform real quick and see if anyone landed. No? Okay. So it looks like we're wasting a lot of time, but if we can get what we're looking for, we will be in better shape. Now, let's try something here real quick while I'm waiting. Because I can't seem to get the computer to do what I want it to do. Let me see if doing that helps. Okay, and back to one. Make sure it's selected and see if that does it. Now, if you can't quite get up there, take the ladder, but do it this way. As you get on it, you use your jetpack. It acts like a flat surface. Just get away from it so you don't accidentally jump on it. All right, these guys just landed. You. Wow, I just bounced off a ship right in front of them. That was pretty cool. Nope, don't have what I'm looking for. Let's go for this guy. I mean, it's the same kind of ship, but hopefully it's a same, it's different inventory. There you go, fungal mold, 162 and cactus flesh. We'll take both. Excellent. So we got plenty of cactus flesh now. We just need one more thing of fungal mold and we're done. And we won't need any more. Let's hit these guys up real quick. Nope. Selenium. Yep, fungal mold. Okay, we're all done. We don't need to stop at those two planets now. And we still haven't gotten the base computer to to hit, unfortunately. I'm going to get the biological entity up there. That's another animal. Okay, so that's nine animals that we've got now. All right, let's go ahead over there to our burial site. It's a little ways away, but it's not a bad thing. You know what we could do? I'm going to waste a little bit of time here. I'm going to go to the base computer, and I'm going to move it by taking it down and then moving it. Look at all those ships coming in. Isn't that great? There is another building down there if you look to the south there, but it's a, it's abandoned structure, and they'll have the uh, eggs there, so you can do that too if you wish. Okay, while we're doing that, is there anything else we can take care of? Let's take care of this. Okay, and if we can get one more thing taken care of in our ship, actually, that should do it. We should get our achievement. Scavenger, there you go. Hopefully the computer thing will start up again in a minute. I'm going to take a look around. we got some creatures. All the same, so that's two on this planet. Up oh, there's a third one right there. Three, and there's usually one flying creature and one more creature to boot. So sometimes we can get them to appear. We've got three, so that's 11 running around creatures. Oh, you know what I'm forgetting? I need sodium, right? There's a sodium patch right down here. It's a small patch, but you don't need a lot. You just need enough to get going. Hi there. Yeah, we're going to be fighting them in just a little bit. I need to do this first. And, by the way, get the other one here. Get about 800 sodium. Uh, sodium. 
silicate. And this planet has a very de high density, much higher density than others. So it, as you can see, it's climbing fast. So there we go. Okay. And we're going to take the big one over here because it's worth more. Okay. We could take the rest if you wanted to, but you're not going to need it. Don't go crazy with it. So have I scanned you yet? No, I have not. That's number four. So that should get me that achievement. There we go. Now, if we can just get the base computer to, to trip at 27 minutes, that ain't too shabby, to be honest with you. We're doing pretty good now. So... Yeah, getting up this thing. Is that copper? Phosphorus, sorry. Yeah, we don't need it. I wondered. I haven't gone this way before. All right, so what we're going to probably end up having to do is we may have to jump out of the game and jump back in to get this computer to trigger. I'm having this problem. I don't know how many people are. A few people are. A few aren't. I'm going to do something first because it needs to be done. Um, no, it doesn't. I'm going to go ahead and jump in and out of my ship, and we're going to re restart the game. Okay, there's our restore point. And, yep, unfortunately, let's try just doing the restore point first. I haven't had a lot of luck with this, but it's worth it. That way I can't see the time I've spent so far. And, no, we're not going to pause the, pause the main time. There's no use in doing so. Don't, don't worry about that over there. It's just a guide anyway. It's just guiding us and telling us where we're at. We've got to get our achievements as soon as we pop up. There we go. So let's jump in here. Um, we have the scavenger, which is giving us 300 sodium, so we need that. Um, this one gives us the hazmat gauntlets, which we don't need, but we need the carbon. So we're going to take that. And let's... This one, Nautilus Chamber. So we're going to go ahead and grab that, too. Okay. Let it go ahead and do that. We're going to put down the portable refiner, and we're going to start making sodium nitrate. Where'd you go? There you are. Half of it ought to do. Got plenty of carbon now. Use it to your heart's content. And there it goes. It just tripped my base computer. Fantastic. So we'll be able to do this now. Look at that. This is going to be a good run. I can already feel it. So we got to go in here. Foundation. Go ahead and drop it. You need the cylindrical room. Move over to one side. And then as soon as it appears, drop it in. Straight corridors. One, two. One more cylindrical room. Three. Let's grab the door. There. Access ramp. There. I put a second one in, in just in case you want to get in there for any reason. Um, nothing else in there. We go over here. You do have to drop these down, so let's... I can't select it. There we go. doesn't make a difference where you put them, actually. Unless you're going to be using them, which I'm not going to. All right, move over to here. We're going to get our batteries set up. We're just going to put two down real quick. I don't know why I exited there. Solar panel. Solar cell things. Done. Um, back to here. I don't know why. Oh, the hazard protection, of course. That and that. And then we just got to go to the base computer, AOMIT base, jump back out, and you get your homecoming established. So go in here. We want to select that because we need it. Okay. And we're going to get into here real quick. Let's build this in our ship. We did get copper as one of our rewards, so you should be able to repair the rest of your ship now. And you are going to need the room, trust me. Let's get rid of the landing pad. We won't need that. Uh, I'm going to move this to the other inventories. Inventory's full. Great. We're going to get rid of that. Let's go ahead and make our antimatter. One, two, three. And we're going to make two antimatter housings. And we're going to make one, two warp cells. And while we're here, we're going to do decorative. Wonder projector. Drop it down. That gets that achievement. Okay. And we need to move stuff from our main inventory out. Uh, let's get rid of the heptaloid weed, which we need for now. I'm going to use that hazard protection. Move that over, that over, that over, that over. Uh, we're going to keep the upgrades in our inventory because we're going to be selling them soon. I want to drop you down here. Uh, that scanner module I'm going to go ahead and install. It's, it's worth something, of course, I know. We're going to put that in my... 
ship. That's a sellable item that goes in the ship. That goes in the ship. Those go in the ship. I'll put that in the ship too. Okay, we got a lot of room taken up by crap in here, but that's okay. And we'll need this later. All right, we're all set. Well, let's go fight some sentinels, shall we? Um, we're gonna before we do that, since we have time, let's grab our sodium nitrate. We're gonna drop our silicate powder in here. Almost enough. Let's go ahead and get that going. Uh, silicate powder. I need. 11. That's all I need. Okay, shall we? And I would put down our Minotaur Geo Bay and use that, but I think it just literally takes too long. And these guys are easy to fight this at this level. And you get to just look in the direction you want them to peer in. We're going to get a doggy in here soon, so... So we got two, and while we're waiting, let's jump over here to four and select it so we know how many we've done. I don't know what he's doing. That guy just dropped a bomb on me. He dropped a bomb on me, baby. Pick those up. You'll need them. Hello. Oh, yeah. I've got to reload. Dummy. That's me. There we go. Got one. Got him. There we go. And we're doing this without the doggy, so that's even better. Another thing we're getting out of this is we're getting Pugnium, which we need. Hey, quit that. Got it. There we go. All healed up. Look at that. Got it. Who's next? You. You. And if you keep the little triangle unit going, you can just take these guys out one by one. We're up to 14 already. Where'd you go? Oh, hi there. Oh, wow. We got a whole bunch of them sitting right there. Keep moving. Another thing you want to keep doing. Reload between deaths as you kill these guys off. There we go. As you get close... take out the triangle unit. So what are we at? What, 17? 18? 19? How many we got out there? Twenty? Twenty-one? Twenty-two? Twenty-three. Got him. Twenty-four. And you're twenty-five. Congratulations. Got him. Twenty-five. Pick that up. Go inside your dormis domicile. And hang out. And it shouldn't take long because they're going to start looking for you in a moment. They should start looking for you in a moment. Okay, this is going to be a problem. So, let's jump in here. Oh, we, we have one more to go. Crap, I didn't know that. We have one more to go. I miscounted. Hi there. What I might do is I might take them both out. There we go. There we go. Now we're healed. <laughs> and if we go in here, it should hide us from them. And what do we got? So do we need anything from that, by the way? No, we don't. Let's go to number two. Do we need anything there? It gives us the Minotaur, but we, we don't need it anymore. So that's it. Let's go back to one. And we need to warp to a new system. So as soon as it becomes available. And do we have any other ones that we're doing. No, we're not. Okay, so let's go ahead and get out of here. What we can do is go to hyperspace real quick. They were searching. 
I'm going to go into my ship, so I'm going to pull a fast one on them. Because they're going to try to send a ship after me, see? There we go. As long as you can get to the hyperspace menu right away, they can't come after you. Next place we're going to go is a pirate system. Bandab is the next one. We're at 36, 37 minutes right now. That's pretty darn good for me. We've already taken out the Sentinels. I don't have to do that at the end. That is the, one of the longest things it takes to get done, usually. The only other long thing that there really, really is at this point is to um, find the, the freighter, the underwater freighter. That takes a couple minutes. So, I think we're doing really, really good here. We could hit the Atlas. Not going to do it. You won't get credit for it, so don't even bother. Head over to that station right there. Yeah, that one right there that you couldn't see because the stupid thing was in the way. Ignore Nada's message. Do not contact him until after you're done with Rendezvous 1. So hit the pirate station here. And we're going to get some stuff. Alright, so what do we got in here? That's good. We're going to move that into the other inventory. We didn't do the um, heptaloid. We didn't make the biscuit, but that's okay. We didn't really need to. All right, everything else in here can stay right where it is. All right, out of the ship, over to the dealer. I'm pretty close by this time. That's nice. And over, and look for the most expensive item and get all five of them. We don't have enough. Hold on a second. Let's jump in here. Uh, sell your partial skeleton thing. Actually, you can get rid of the hydrophone of uh, The marine shelter you won't need, so let's get rid of those. It's not much, but hey, own oh, the bromide salt, which you get a lot of money for, by the way. All right, so that's selling. Back to buying. This one, all five, we'll take them. The one thing we haven't done yet... Okay. Weapon shard we don't need. Let's go ahead and grab them, because you've actually got so much in here... It's worth selling some stuff. So take the couple extra moments. You're going to get tons of nanites. So jump in here and get rid of some of the stuff you got. Like this. Magnetic resonator. You don't need those. And you're not going to need the Sentinel Boundary Mat, the Viking Effigy, or the Dirty Bronze. Just get rid of them. They're clogging up your inventory. You were looking for upgrades anyway. And we're going to get rid of the upgrades real quick and sell those off. This guy doesn't really have anything for us. Uh, we don't really need the weapon shard anymore either. He doesn't have any hyperspace upgrades or anything like that, so there's nothing really that we need. The movement module could have came in handy, but I'm not worried about it. We're out of here. Now, normally I would go through a black hole at this point. We're not going to. We're going to go to the next system. Here's the thing. Everybody worries about, you know, oh, you're going to get caught by the... Uh, they're they're going to scan your ship at some point. you got the illegal stuff on it. While Nada's message is still ending you will not get bothered by anybody because that's a secondary message they can't bother you while there's a message pending brilliant so a little bit of a loophole there works for you so 40 minutes and we are coming up at one of the main systems we do need to hit the space station here you don't have to get words if you don't wish to um i sometimes well, um hello my mouse was suddenly not being paid attention to for some reason. And we're in. So we're going to sell the stuff here. We need ionized cobalt. I mentioned that earlier. We will get the salt after we get to Rendezvous 1. And you can talk to people while you're here. The ionized cobalt is in the back room, so head that way. And the dealer out here, the spaceship dealer for upgrades, um, is going to have a hyperspace upgrade. And I also need a pulse engine upgrade. So sell. I don't need to sell. Buy. There's the ionized cobalt. We'll get 100 of it. Ooh, look at that, huh? I'll get an extra few. And we're going to get some copper, too. I just like to have a little extra copper on hand. It's just me. And there's nothing else in here that we can really use. So get out of here. And we're going to go over this guy here and get our our spaceship upgrade while he, you know, bows to me for some reason. Because, you know, obviously I want him to do that. C-class, S-class. Put him in your ship immediately so you don't forget. And take them back out as far as that one's concerned. And hyperspace. You need that. You're going to need the second one that you're going to be getting in a little bit. All right. And if you want to get words, you can. I'm choosing not to. 
and I'm leaving. The only other thing we needed, we needed pugnium and condensed carbon. The carbon we're going to get on our own, uh, we need to go to hyperspace. So don't accidentally choose the talk to Nada thing. It will cause you problems. Uh, we're not going to go there. We're going to go here. I don't know why it shows you another pirate station. Doesn't make any sense to me, but... So we're doing pretty good here. 45 minutes and we're going to come up to Rendezvous 1. That sounds like it's a lot of time. But the way I'm going, I expect that the time on that on that clock over there is going to be showing somewhere around the 120 to 125 mark, which is going to be phenomenal. Which means I should be below an hour in game time. Really excited about this. Okay, we're not going to go there. You have to choose, if I can get this off my screen, you got to go back in here and choose Rendezvous 1. And Rendezvous 1 should be right there. There it is. And you will invariably not be directed at rendezvous once. See, I'm off a little bit. So it's probably choosing a base or a save point or something like that that somebody put on there. Um, this is a time to go back in here, check to make sure you have everything in order that you don't want to worry about. Um, we have the glass. I'm going to put that in my ship. I never sold the first spawn relics. But you know what? We're heading to an archive on the ground. I just can't forget to sell it. Huh. We got a couple of uh, antimatters. Not that we need those. And while you're in your starship, you're not going to need this anymore. We've already gone to the pirate system, so get rid of it. It's just taking up space anyway. Okay, I think we're doing pretty good. All right. I think we're in good shape. We're not going to uh, unlock that one thing on the uh, multi-tool. There's one more spot on there that takes uh, sodium nitrate. You don't need to. You already got that achievement. Now's a good time to readjust. And get lined back up with your archive. There we go. I think we're lined up now. Maybe. Good. Yeah, we got it this time. And again, we're going to divert power to... It says weapons. It'll switch over and say shields in just a moment. Engines, pardon me. In just a moment. There we go. So that gives us a little more boost to our engines. Makes it a little bit faster to get to where we're going. It doesn't look like it, but trust me, it is going faster than it was before. And the archive should pop in now. There it is. And I always go to the upper platform. You could do the cactus and fungal mold here if you wanted to. But there's less parking and you'd have to run all over the place. It makes it a lot more difficult to do it here. All right. Rendezvous 1 is complete. Hit this guy right here. He has a couple things for you. One of the things he has is, in the purchase components area... Solar mirror. Grab it. None of these other things you really need unless you want to grab these two to get a little more dihydrogen. Um, there's nothing for you to sell except for the first, first spawn relics. I just remembered that. And that should be it. Good. And while you're here, hit them one more time. If I can get that off my screen. And we can do this in the other place, but I don't want components. I did it again. I need blueprints. And we need the advanced mining laser. Do that now while you're thinking of it. Here we go. Uh, I'm going to put you here. I'm going to put the advanced mining laser over there. So we got everything. That's what I needed the hermetic seals for earlier. So now we got that. We're all set. Before we leave, go through your scanner. Scan one of the trees. Uh, we got to scan if I can get zoomed in on this guy. There we go. That guy. And there's a rock right down there. Scan the rock. One plant, one animal, one rock. And you get that. Now, we do need to do the freighter. The water freighter. We're going to leave here. Because there's too many bases around here. But if you go to the left and go out into the water here, get past these save points, and go out in the middle of this stuff over here, I'm going to go this way. And I'm going to hit one of these tiny, tiny little islands here. It should get us away from everybody. There we go. And looks like our launchers are doing good. Z, Nautilin, go underwater a little bit and should be able to... Yeah, I, it is underwater. Oh, it constructed it. All right, so before you do anything, go to your exocraft. Let's put this thing in. You notice we don't have enough crystal sulfides. Deconstruct it. And then go back in. And use those things you just got to finish it. Okay. Swim out. Jump in. X. Scan. Look for that. And get back out of your ship. 
sunken wreck has already been detected and you can just go to your ship and fly to it. Now, if you're lucky and you find the sunken wreck that's still sticking out of the water, you can land just about on the ship itself. And it looks like my uh, life support is dropping. How far away? 27. That's not too shabby. I'll go up a little higher so we can gain some speed. Hopefully it's sticking out of the water. If it's submerged, we're going to have a little bit of trouble. His closest island is pretty far away. Let's see what happens as we get close. Nope, this one's too far down. I know this one. So we can land right here. This is okay. It's not terrible. Not the closest one, but it is okay. And as much as I'd like to just start running there, I'm going to turn around and get a running start and jetpack out and use that as a boost to get down there. And we got to get our life support going here in just a minute. Okay. Done. Shouldn't have to update your life support again. So this is the longest one because this goes through a lot of this here, but this is it. Everything else should be fairly quick. Not bad. Can't believe we're leaving here and it's not even an hour yet. We should be hitting the Sentinel ship quickly. Okay, we got that. So this is the hard part, is getting back out of this thing. Keep swimming. Remember Dory. Just keep swimming. Just keep swimming, swimming, swimming. So when we uh, destroyed the Nautilin base, it gave us 100 salt. So that's why you don't have to get any salt later. Because you do need it, but I need condensed carbon. There's something else I need. I need a backpack refiner. Don't we all? Into the ship. And we're out of this place. We are done here. Okay. I gotta stop that. One thing we gotta do. We need a reward first. Um, let's go ahead and grab that. That gives us 10 warp cells. And... So we'll grab the other one, too, while we're at it. Okay, and let's pull in the anomaly. We forgot about that. That's the thing. I should be doing this while I'm going into the anomaly. I'm wasting time. Okay, good. Let's head towards it. Because I kept thinking I needed to uh, hyperspace someplace, but nope. All right, anything else we need to do here? Uh, so phase one still has a reward to get, and that's this one. We don't need... Wait a second. Powerful pulse engine, powerful movement system. Yes, actually, that one we did kind of do. My bad. Because that's why I was having a little trouble with that. Um, let's see. There it is. That. I'll put you in place. Get rid of the egg. You don't need it. My nice cobalt can go in your ship. This you can get rid of. And let's get out. Got some things to do. Oh, yeah, great. Pluck me at the furthest place away. Every time. That's okay. We're doing good. Now, you do have to do a tour of this place, unfortunately. But that's okay. I'm going to teach you a little something here. When you talk to Nada, go through the first two things. See? Gives you three options. Do the first one. Do the first one again. And then this time, do the second one, which is leave. You don't need to ask about Polo. He's going to tell you. And you just eliminated two more conversations. Just leave. Don't talk to him for help. You can just go. You're done. You've satisfied the objectives. You don't have to keep talking to them. A lot of people keep talking to them. Go in here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. And get your ceiling light. Go over here. You've got plenty of nanites, Dale. Remember, you sold them all. Grab your backpack refiner. See, i got 3,500 nanites. So 3,000 now. We've already got our up upgrade for our multi-tool. Go in here. And over to the right, we're going to get acid. Lubricant. Unstable gel. And the liquid explosive. And before you go anywhere... Sorry, go back in there. I'm going to build my refiner. We don't have enough oxygen, okay? So you can you can uh, uninstall one of these to get oxygen, but here's something you can do. you got to hit Ares and... Um, I know the other guy. Hold on. Um, hold on a second. It's not registering. There we go. There we go. Helios. I just remembered his name before it showed up. 
And just go ahead, you can grab some more nanites if you want. Now, sometimes I do just for the heck of it, because it takes almost as long. But when you hit up Ares, get an upgrade for your exosuit. So go to three, purchase upgrades. Because I didn't get enough oxygen earlier. Um, look for life support module. And when you put that in, just uninstall it and you get a bunch of oxygen. Now we have enough oxygen to build this. Go ahead in here, put some carbon in, and then go over here and add more carbon. They're uh, not condensed, regular. Because you need a lot of condensed carbon. So go ahead and get that going. Um, if I get through that. And we got to go hit the Nexus real quick. Just in and out. There we go. That takes care of that. 52 minutes. Yeah, we should be getting that Sentinel pretty quick here soon. There we go. Go to the portal. Teleport terminus. My bad. In. Out. I used to go to my base at that point, but don't do it. Because it automatically triggers your other anomaly mission. Go ahead and do it while you're here. That knocks out both anomaly missions in one shot. He only talks for four sentences. Two, three, and four. Five. Five sentences. We're done. You'll never have to come back to the anomaly again. So that takes care of that. 53 minutes. Remember, we also reloaded at one point, so we're actually doing better time than we think. All right, off we go. Whew. Tough. All right. Is there anything we need to do in here? I don't think so. All right, so we'll get away from the station just a little bit and go to hyperspace, which I forgot. Hold on. I have to charge it. That's what we needed that for. All right. So where to? We want to go to the anomaly. So hold on a second here. and, and, and There it is. So we're going to go to the anomaly first, and then we're going to go through a black hole, and we're going to go back to our base. And when we build the base, we should also put down the nutrient processor and make our biscuit. We can also, while we're waiting for our ship to land, we're going to build the liquid explosive. Actually, we can do the nutrient processor there, too, if we want. It doesn't make a difference where we do it, as long as we get it done. Here we go. I'm really excited about this one. I think we're doing really, really good. There's our friend. I'm going to go right through these guys. I don't care. I got power diverted to engines. Almost didn't catch me there. But you know what? While we're going in here, let's do something. Unstable gel, acid, liquid explosive. While we're at it, we're going to clear some of this nonsense out of here. Um, we can get rid of our cactus flesh and our fungal mold now, as well as our mordite. We don't need them anymore. Let's move some stuff around, because we need to make some room for other stuff, unfortunately. Pulse engine module. Do we have enough cadmium? Nope. Let's go ahead and do that. All right. While you're here, don't go that way. Go this way first. Hit that bubble. You get the word, the, or no, you should get Atlas from that. And here's your second word that you get, which is Traveler. So now we are up to 11 words. We need 16 total. You'll get three at the Sentinel Planet, and two more when you come back to the Atlas. All right, we're going to take a little trip here. Okay, off we go. Now, if you choose Resist, it'll always make you end up on a planet that has the cactus flesh on it. So you can do that there. It's a shame it doesn't have anomalous animals. It would be great. You'd hit that at the same time. Too bad. You got a lot to do in this system here. So we're going to be getting our Sentinel ship here. We're also going to be getting all four memories, which is why I put that stuff in my refiner to get uh, condensed carbon out of it. Woo. Okay. Pulling our ship. Let's go ahead and put down our nutrient processor. If we can get that off my screen. There we go. We're going to go ahead and do the heptaloid wheat. Let's go ahead and get that done. Just need one. There we go. Thank you. Uh, I don't need that yet. 
Let's put in... And I got rid of the cactus flesh. Which I needed. If I've remembered correctly, though, I think there might be... If I'm lucky, sweet root somewhere near here, but I guess not. So I messed up already, but that's okay. We'll figure it out later. Let's get going. We don't need to worry about that. Minor, minor setback. We should be able to do it when we go to our planet. Actually, I think there's some on the planet that we're going to. All right, where is... There it is. So there is the planet, the little guy over there to the right. Before we go, we need to get our objective which is going to be in phase two here and go in here and create that memory of ocean before we exit i just need to go in here and take out my condensed carbon okay let's go pulse drive go into your ship select it searching at the bottom right we should be able to get all four done Talk. Now, if you get the timing right, you should be able to go to the escape menu immediately and get the achievement and then go in and build it. There we go. So I'm going to get the reality grains. We've already got that. Watch this. And it'll tell me we can make that now. Hit tab and tab again, and you can get in here immediately. Put that in your... You don't need these. You do need that, by the way. Grab that and put it in. Make the second one. Exit. Go into pulse. Clear, tab, and select. And there we go. Walk to this guy and do the same exact thing. Just do this two more, three more times after the two more times after this. Okay, and that one is over here. Unbounded. We need that. Save it. Now, this one needs dihydrogen. We're short dihydrogen. We're going to have to get it from the planet, and we'll have to do the last two on the way back. That... Wait a second. We do have something. Hold on. Don't we got that? This will give us 80 more. I don't think that's enough, though. We'll see in a minute. Let's find out. Shall we? Can we? Yeah, we got enough now. Glad, but glad I grabbed that, right? Tab. Select, and we can do all three now. Four. Pugnium's the last one. We got plenty of that now, don't we? Okay, you ready? We're going to get it at four. Deep glass. Tab. Uh, auto charger you can use. Definitely need that. Put this in your ship. And then go ahead and make your void. And go ahead and go into pulse. Hit it. And when this guy pops up... Before I do anything, I'm going to do that. And it's going to find my dissonance spike while I'm talking. Okay, there we go. And we got all them. And just aim for the dissonant spike, which in this case is the bottom this time. And just pulse. And you're done. We got all four of the memories done. And we're still we're just coming up on an hour. And we're coming up on our sentinel ship. We don't really have a lot more to go. I think 20 minutes tops. Maybe 25. I don't know. But we'll see what happens here. Looks like we've got an archive over there on the right. Alright. And there should be some sweet root near here. Go ahead and come in for a landing. Looks like we got a lot of stuff near us and no storm at the moment, so we're in good shape. And I want to take a look real quick because I need that sweet root. And that's going to be a problem if I can't find any. Oh, wow, look at that. We got a mirror over there. Fabulous. Keep looking, keep looking, keep looking. Huh, no plants, huh? All right. We may have to get it on another planet. That's okay. Uh, and that there was what I'm looking for up here. Good. I need those things. Let's go ahead and head over there. Make sure we're on mining beam. And we've got our advanced mining laser. Oh, don't tell me those aren't radiant shards. Radiant shard. Good. Okay, looks like we got at least two, maybe three. Three it is. 
Yep. We just need three. We don't need a fourth one, I found. All right. And where is the nearest guy there? 403. I mean, oh, what's that? Heptaloid. We go figure. Okay. Let's go ahead and take our ship over there. And don't forget to keep checking your launch thrust, launch uh, auto charger, launchers, whatever. Your thrusters to get off the ground. Oh, looks like we had some stuff behind us we could have taken. That's okay. So, not enough. See? Look at that. And it was just shy. It was one point shy. We're going to take the ship there because we want to be protected from the elements. Be able to jump at a moment's notice if we have to. And we're going to check for Sweet Root while we're here. All right. Let me see. Is there any Sweet Root nearby? Let's go this way. Strange that it would be on this planet, but you know, you never know. Okay, we don't have any. Let's go ahead and hit this guy. We're going to use our bolt caster. Oh, it's an echolocator, for crying out loud. Okay, we're going to have to find another one. Alright. Nope, don't get in your ship. Let them look for you. You get in your ship, you're going to have sentinel ships all over your butt. See, they just pop out of the ground in front of you. And I hate that. It drives me nuts. And you got to run even further. And my jetpack won't charge up quick enough, so... Four, and a storm coming up. Two, one, and we're good. Let's look. While we're here... Harmonic scrap. We just found a campsite. How oh, very, very interesting. And an archive. How far away is the archive? I just had an idea. I have an idea. We have navigation data we can call our ship in. And there's protection here to be found. If I can get there. It's okay. We got batteries. Use them. Oh, good. Half up. And we're in. Gotta hit this guy. See if he has anything we can use. We just need something that we can use to cook, and I don't think he'll have it, but the ships might. Uh, let's go ahead and pull our ship in. Oh, there's a ship there. Good. Let me pull our ship in then. There we go. <laughs> let's see if this guy has anything we can use. Ugh. And of course, he's not showing here. There we go. See if we get lucky. I don't think any of those are going to get me some sugar. Oh, he just left. It's the one over there. Let's see if we can get him in time. Just need a little bit of cactus flesh. Oh my gosh, you got to be kidding me. We got it. Good. We can stand right here to do it. So we can do this while we're here. Grab the cactus flesh. Awesome. We just saved ourselves here. And that. And then one more time. There we go. We got it. That takes care of that. Okay, let's take a look around. We're looking for... We already got him. Okay, let's go back to the site real quick. Um, let me guess. The site disappeared as soon as we left. Okay, let me look. It's right in front of me. Okay, good. Wow, did we get lucky. 
that would have been a mistake. If my wings will ever fold in and will drop. Wow, that's one of the things I really don't like about the solar ships. Okay, let's do this. There's another one right there. How far away? I hope it's not the same one. We're going to have to take our ship there because of the storm. I was hoping to get this done before the storm hit, but it is what it is. And this is a long-lived storm. Oh, what do you know? He's in the middle of a cluster of storm crystals. Let's get up here because we're going to need the protection. I can't seem to get him. Did we get it? Oh, we did. My bad. Let's get out of here. Head in one direction and then go on a right angle. Four, three, two, one, and done. Okay, we're good. Let's head back to our ship. And we're going to go ahead and look for the ancient place. That might have ruined us right there, unfortunately. Nope, oh, it's over there. Good. How far? 20 seconds away. Down to, down to 12. Excellent. About time. A very long storm. So, remember, we have 11 words. We get three more here. One. Go ahead and take it. It's going to take a couple extra seconds, but no longer than you would be talking to somebody on a station. The difference is you get two more over here. One and two without any of the delays. And you'll get two more at the Atlas. So we're up to 14 now. And we'll complete them when we get there. All right, done. Let's go to our ship. And all we need to do now is claim it. Uh, there we go. So we'll be off this planet at around the 110 mark. Depending on how long it takes our ship to land. Ah! Hate those things. Procedurally generated right in front of me. Use it while you have it. Do that. Air. Claim. You've got it. Achievement taken. Get back in your ship and get out of there. Just over 110. Okay, we're done. Done with that. Okay. Our next place of to, to uh, visit from here is going to be a black hole. And I always like to go to this... Whoop, where'd it go? Hold on, it was just there. This one, because of where the black hole takes you. So we're at 110, I'm thinking 125. Should be about 15 more minutes and we should be able to get this. Again, if I can just break to 59 minutes, if I can get under one hour, I will be so happy. It'll be so much better. Okay, off to the black hole itself. One, two presses, and that should get us more power to our engines to get us there quicker. You can get fungal mold at that planet if you need it, but that's what we've just avoided. So that saves us a couple of minutes. I mean, it's at least a half minute to 45 seconds to get there, to land, to go find the stuff. It actually takes a little bit of time. Harvest it, jump back in your ship, and then take off and get back to the black hole and go through it. You're literally wasting minutes. So we've saved ourselves a lot of time, I think personally, by getting it from the landing, from the trading post. I love this system. This is awesome. I love coming out of the system here. Okay. 
Oink. Okay. Now, if you want, you can clear out your, your vocabulary here by talking to two more people. I usually do, just because. I at least get one more. If I can get one more person, we're good. It takes an extra couple moments, but it's not a big, big deal. You have to head this way anyway. There's nothing to purchase here. Don't bother going to any terminals or selling anything. There's a guy right in front of you. Go ahead and grab him. That's one down. We'll grab the other one while we're here. That way we've completed it. And that's one less thing we got to worry about. Done. We're out of here. And just go through your base, and you're going to go back to your base. You got to do things there anyway. You got to put your light in. You got to put all the glass panels in. So we'll get that done. We've already got our nutrient processor done. And yes, we left it behind, but we don't need to worry about it. So we're excellent. We're doing really, really good right now. None of this time, you know, going through the teleporters, the warp, the black hole, none of that counts. This is frozen time for us. <laughs> Sorry. That's just funny. I like how it just landed me right up here. That is great. Whoops, wrong side. I want to get on the side where my ship is because I can see everything a little bit better. Okay. So we need those. I don't even have to go inside. One. What are we missing? We're missing silver. Okay, hold on. What can we deconstruct that gives us silver? Hold on. Corridors? Ferrite dust. Door? Ferrite dust. Oh, crap. We're in trouble. Oh, we were doing so well. Why are we short on silver? We should have plenty. I know something gives it to us. Let's pause for a second and take a look. And maybe I can salvage this. And yeah, I do this too. Silver. Give it a few seconds. We don't need a lot of it, but we need enough. And it's used to build. Mm -hmm. Bulkhead door, really? Mm. Interesting. Wow, it builds a lot of stuff, you know. Oh, okay, so inside, right inside freighters. Of course, I knew that. Can we deconstruct those and get silver out of them? Let me check. It's over here. No, it won't. What about this? Nope, that doesn't either, but I'm going to put it in anyway. What about you? Nope, that gave us sodium. Where's our silver at? There it is. Hold on. I don't need this anymore, so I'm going to put it down here and take a look. Can we put that in there and get something out of it? No. Not that either, right? Didn't think so. These don't give us anything, right? Worth checking if it takes us an extra few seconds. Uh, let's see. Copper. At the locator? No? Okay. can't believe I still have that. Plenty of of gold. You noticed that, didn't you? And I know you, a lot of you are going to watch this later and say, you could have done... Hmm, interesting. Thermic layer and toxin suppressors. Aronium. I 
and dirty bronze. I believe. Granatine Herox. Okay. There we go. There it is. Ah, uh, this is a waste. I can't believe this happened. Yep, I didn't think so. All right. We only have one recourse, and that is to go after some asteroids and then come back. And of course, there's not going to be any asteroids near me, right? Nope, I don't see an asteroid. Oh, there's an asteroid field right there. Okay. So we need about 50 silver. This is going to wreck my run, just so you know. And I just had a bunch of ships pop in, which means the asteroid field moves. So glad we're getting tritium. Actually easier. I found it's easier to do it this way than to just go to the trade station and look for somebody. Because there's usually not somebody anywhere that can give you all that. Because that's one of the things we needed to look for. And I forgot. How much do we have? We're up to 40. I need 50. Let's see how much we got. 56. I think that's enough. If this wrecks it, it wrecks it. Where's my building at? There are so many bases on this planet, it's almost impossible to find anything. There's my base. Okay. And we should be there in about 10 seconds. Yeah, that wrecked the run right there, unfortunately. What a waste. I didn't realize I needed more silver. Back to the building here. Okay, one, two. There we go. And glass roofed. One, two, three. And we want to put the dome on. And then we're going to move over. And we're going to put in chair, table, wall screens. One, two, three. We're putting them on the ground. Too bad. Putting that there. And... Oh, the light, of course. There we go. That should do it. We're done with the base. So while we're here, let's go back into the escape menu and take a look. So we got... One is complete. Two is almost complete except for the rendezvous. Three is almost complete except for rendezvous. Four is almost complete except for rendezvous. And five, we will complete real quickly. So it looks like we have a short one alien word, so I'm glad I hit that guy up. That would have been embarrassing. I don't know how I ended up with that. I must have miscounted on the first run. All right, so here we go. Now it's the crazy jumping everywhere type thing. Let's see how well, how well we do. Because I don't know how much time we wasted, if it was a lot or not. But I think we wasted a good amount of time that negated all the things that we were short on. So we'll see what happens. It was such a good run. It was such a good run. It was so close. It's a shame. It's going to take me at least 10 minutes to get all this done. So we'll be at a 1.30 mark on that clock, but I don't know how much is going to count against us. Alright, so we have the rendezvous has already selected. It should be right here, and is actually pretty close. We got our pulse drive is upgraded, our landing gear is upgraded. As it comes in for an actual landing landing we should be in good shape. So this one is just above that and to the left. I don't know why they disappear. We've all been complaining about it. There it is, right there. Okay. Doesn't look like much needs to be charged. Scan the tree. There's a rock right in front of me. And 
creatures should be appearing. We'll grab you. And three. Done. Get back in the ship and leave. Nothing more to do here. We're done. Rendezvous two is complete. We're on to rendezvous three. Okay. We are going to have to charge our hyperdrive soon. There, that way. There it goes. There you go. So it's basically just going to all, well, the next three, the next three rendezvous, rendezvous three, four, and five, hitting the Atlas, getting our anomalous animal, and that's it. And then we should be done. We know we're short a word, but we'll get it inside the Atlas. It's not a problem. And I think rendezvous three is there. Uh, let's see if we can't get lined up for once. On our way. Okay. We're a little off, it looks like. But, we're at least on the planet. And in the right general vicinity, so at least that's something. So, if we go in here, we can check. Um, again, we don't need any of these upgrades. We're good. We are going to need one more. And that we're going to get at number four. Um, I'm going to take that one because we need the Supreme Movement System upgrade. Uh, let me move you out of the way. And where'd you go? There you are. Excellent. So that'll help out greatly. We don't need this anymore. We don't need that anymore. Get rid of the echolocator and the cookie. Don't need the weapon shard. Okay, we're in good shape. Go ahead and get rid of that. Alright, we're in good shape. So the next upgrade we're going to need is going to come from... Rendezvous 4, we're going to get the Fallen. We have to get that in order to be able to get... Um, ...our upgrade for our hyperdrive for... ...Indium, the Indium hyperdrive upgrade. This should be a freighter. There she is. And we're landing. We're using its landing pad, so it'll recharge. It'll help recharge our landing pad itself, our, our launch fuel, so we don't use it. We I go all the way over here because everything I need is right here. We scan that rock under the water. There's a plant just south of that, right about there. Two, and then get the bug-like creatures that are flying around. Three, we're done. Because they don't appear anywhere else, so there's no use in doing it anywhere else. Back to your ship. And leave. We're done with three. Now, I used to get my Atlas staff at this point. I don't see any reason to do so. We'll go ahead and leave. Uh, who do we need to charge? Launch thrusters, we'll go ahead and do. And we'll go into hyperspace. Looks like we got plenty of charge on our hyperdrive. That way. So we're going to number, whoop, not there, not there, four. There we go. So as you can see, it's about two minutes per rendezvous at this point. Because they have the rendezvous uh, three, four, and five. They're pretty far away, all of them. So it takes you a good 30 to 45 seconds to get to each rendezvous. And then you got to land, and then you got to do the things, and then get back in your ship and leave. Now, four is a little different because we got to get in the ship and jump over and hit that gravestone across the water. So make sure, we've done three, four is next, rendezvous, make sure it's selected, it's to the right. I'm always going to the left. And I'm trying to line this one up just right, if I can get it. It's close. Okay. And we'll head there, and as you can see, yeah, say 40 seconds to get there. Yeah. Not much I can do to change that. Is there any other upgrades we need? Nope. We already got that. Don't need it. Don't need it. Definitely don't need it. So we've got all the upgrades we need, and we're pretty much done at this point. So once we do number four, we get the rendezvous done and the research. We go on to five. We go to that rendezvous directly. We'll have to put the upgrade in after we hit the fall in, though. Or else we can't get to upgrade number... F uh, pardon me, rendezvous five. Let's see if we're still lined up. Pretty good. Um, it looks like we're a little off. It's going to jet past it on the left-hand side here. So, as we get close, we'll uh, pull out. 
There we go. And go down here. Line back up. Nope. Would you stop that? It's not letting us. All right, we're going to have to go the old-fashioned way. I've already changed my power over to my drive. And we'll take it in the long way. Okay. Now, right across the white expanse there, just northwest of there, is going to be our gravestone. There is our portal. Right here. Okay. Yeah, it's going to be past 1.30 when we're done with this. Scan that. Scan that. And... we got to find a rock, unfortunately. This landscape is devoid of a lot of rocks. There's one right there. And before you leave here, just jump over here and highlight your unknown grave. Get in the ship and on our way. I don't know why, but for some reason the end music comes on at this point. Doesn't make any sense to me. Rondi, uh, what do you call it? Number five is not... I don't know why it suddenly wouldn't land. Whew. That was a waste. Okay. Okay, we'll grab this. Okay, we're good. Jump in the ship. Okay, go over here. I haven't gotten our reward. That's going to be a number five right there. And we put it in now. Indium drive. And now we can go into hyperspace. Everybody's this way. That's okay. All right. So our last location is right here. 129. And we still have to hit the Atlas. So we'll hit Rendezvous 5. Do our scans. Leave. And then we're going to go to the Atlas. We'll get our last word in there at the same time. And then we'll exit there and go to the anomalous, uh, anomalous animal. Hopefully we haven't wasted enough time, but I'm not, I'm not very hopeful. And you got to get into five and choose the rendezvous five or else it won't show up. There we go. I think we're lined up okay. I've had a couple times when I want to choose that, but someone, some bozo put a, put a base, and I'm going to say it that way, I'm sorry, put a base right here on this planet closest to us, right where your line of sight is to get to that particular to there. It's just why people do that. I know they do it. In that case, that was done purposely. It had to be. There's no way that someone would have coincidentally produced a base at that exact spot to screw up people's runs and stuff like that. So, anyway. Head for one of these two bases over here. One of them has the Thing at it. You can usually start to see it, I think. Is it up here? I can't see a blessed thing in here. Nope, that's not it. There it is. Okay, it's right below me. Okay, that'll get us our achievement. Go over here. Plants are all over the place. They're on the ground. Just grab one. There's a big rock up here. There it is, too. And just zoom in on one of those guys. Get the third one. You're done. Get in your ship. Once the achievement goes away on your screen, and you're done here. Okay. The next place to go is going to be the Atlas. Uh, Atlas location this way. Yep, that's the one. All right. Land at the Atlas. Make sure you choose the milestone from your inventory of milestones. 
And then as soon as we leave there, we should be able to word there that'll complete that one and the atlas, and then we're going to go to the anomalous planet and find one anomalous animal. There we go. In we go. Go in here. Choose return to atlas. We're going to get this one while we're in here. It's a shame. I'm pretty sure that the silver um, situation wasted me a few minutes, two or three minutes. So it's going to make all the difference. Oh, okay, it's going to put me on the far platform. That's fine. Just got to head to that one little ball there in the middle of the pathway down the down to the atlas. Okay, down we go. There we go, and there's our language. Got a warp core out of it. Great. And onwards. There we go. We're done here. Ending music for the second time. And we're going to head to the planet in this system that has an exotic... That's an exotic world that'll have an anomalous creature on it. So, yeah. Sorry, guys. I was really, really so positive that we were going to get it done this time. But I don't have the luck of the Jason, so... Get down to the planet as quick as possible. Make sure, of course, we put a cloud in my way. And I'm already scanning around with my eyes to see if there's any creatures floating around. Nope, oh, there's one right there. And done. Hit the achievement, get it off my screen so I can get in and out of my ship. And we're done. Stop our timer. Yeah, that's a shame. I mean, I know I spent some time in the escape menu, but uh, let's check out to see what we did, shall we? Not too keen on this one. Not too keen, but let's see what happens. I'm thinking like 102. <sighs> 106, that's even more horrible than I thought. I can't believe we wasted that much time. So... I'm going to go again and see what we can do. Am I going to do it now? Absolutely. So let's see. We're at 138. Let's write that down. I've got a pencil right here. One that just broke. Grab the other pencil. 138 is what I'm going to put on our data to show that we did it a second time at 138. And let's keep going with the record, record, shall we? All right, so we got rid of that one. Okay, so we know our mistakes. We need to get more silver this time, but I don't want to focus so solely on that that I forget the other things. So when we get to the planet, we need heptalade wheat and the three buried items. We need carbon. We need a, any sodium we can find, but we are going to get it at the planet I land on, so I'm not too, too concerned about that. Um, condensed carbon... So we get our six plants, we'll scan at least eight animals, maybe nine. We get fortunate. Okay, ready? Oh, we need to reset our timer. There we go. And we're on our way. Whoop, it didn't register. There it goes. Okay, so it's going to be off by a second or two. No big deal. Wow, bright screen, huh? Nighttime, that's actually pretty good. We can see things a little bit better sometimes. Certain things that are glowing. I can't tell you how many times I've started underwater on this one, too can't see too too much because we're literally on a slight hill got plenty of plants around us i'm not worried about that sometimes we get fortunate i'll see a bunch of di like a dihydrogen field looks like we got some oxygen right there that might be some dihydrogen down there but i can yell no that's condensed carbon right there on my right good yeah it's glowing a little bit red and I think that's my ship right in front of me. Oh my gosh, really? All right, that's fabulous. All right, we're going to take a look through here. Let's get some plants real quick. 
And while we're scanning the plants, that's two. And there's a third one, three. Buried mineral, okay, good. Uh, no, four, five. And did we scan this one yet? Nope, six. All right, we got all six. I think I know this one. Is it just the one there, or is it two? I think it's just one. Yeah, just the one. There is a second one there. Two. Excellent. Okay, we got lucky. And the ship, like I said, is literally right here. Um, do we have any buried tech nearby or heptaloid wheat? Impulse beans, of course. I'm just going to check around. I think there's some heptaloid wheat real close by, but I don't remember where. Get up the hill. We're getting a little bit disoriented. All right, let's head to the ship. Got our six. Okay, that's one. Oh, hey, stop. We'll need this at the start. Going to help us quite a bit. We're going to get some more carbon. Anything else on this side? No, we're good. One. Gives us 57. 60. Whoop. Easy. 100. Hundred and sixty. That should give us the 200 we need. Okay, that's a good start. Ship is right here. That is fabulous. We'll need more oxygen. Let's drop our refiner down. And grab things. First things first. Let's grab you out of here. Grab that. Grab that. Okay. Did we grab the things out of the... There we go. Grab that too. Life support gel. How nice. I'm going to drop that in, and we're going to drop in our metal. We need one more buried thing, and we need a heptaloid wheat. There's a buried cast 30 away. Let's get some animals while we're at it. Star Bramble, that doesn't help me any. Impulse. Argo. Buried cash. it's a little closer. Impulse beans, let's head up there. I think there's a heptaloid wheat on the other side of all this. And we definitely need to make sure we get some uh, dihydrogen while we're out here. We got you. Watch for the heptaloid wheat, because I think it's close by, but it's next to some other item, and we can't see it. And three. Another biological entity. Another biological entity. So we're up to four. That's five now. Four. We're still at four. Five. Six. I like when they run at me. Grab these. Grab them. Got them. Okay, good. I'm going to head over there. I th think there is more than one plant there. But we really need the wheat. Because that's the biggest thing that we kind of need around here. That's number seven. Get some oxygen while we're here. We do need a bunch of oxygen, so we're going to make sure we grab that. That's number eight. Impulse beans again. 
But again, I just want to double check because I've had that happen. Let's grab a word while we're here. That's going to help us a little bit. Okay, that's another word. Okay, good. That's one word anyway. All right, I am not finding the wheat here, and that's bothering me a lot. I do know there's some on the planet, so I can grab some while we're there. So I think we'll do that where we make our base. How are we doing on items? Let's check. We got 62 hydrogen dihydrogen. We could use more. Okay. But we what we really need is we need a lot of oxygen. It's copper. Yeah, okay, just wondering. Let's get this going on your We'll talk to this real quick. And we'll get out of here. And is there any birds flying around we can get a ninth or tenth animal out of? Okay, why am I not getting that scanning? Okay, good. So that's a ninth animal. So we only need three animals at the next one. Uh, let's grab this and get out of here. We haven't made anything yet. Okay, we need the jelly and the metal plate. We'll need a lot more dihydrogen, so we're going to have to keep our eyes out for it. Okay. Okay, we're done. And we're probably not going to be lucky enough to have the planets nearby. Okay, they are right there. Okay. So we're going to head to our silver planet right there. Or, pardon me. Uh, if I can get out of this mode. There we go. If I can get it to stop locking on to settlements, we're just going to head to that planet right now and get in there. Okay, while we're waiting... It'll always be at the last one, so go ahead and get your exobiology reward. And get your one man's treasure. So now you got everything you need. So let's get in here, and we're going to move things over. We're not going to need this. I am going to move it over in case we do, but we're not going to need it. Uh, let's move some things. There we go. Put you down here and get you out of the way. We will see what we can do. I don't know what this turns into, but we'll see. All right, we're about to come in on the planet. And just get a different angle. Straight down as soon as it gives us the chime. There it is. Take a picture. Give it a moment. There it goes. All right, and we're out of here. And next planet is our... It's going to be over here. So let's go ahead and go over this way. And should be showing. There she is. Head that way. While we're doing that, let's go to the starship. Let's fix some stuff. we got a little bit of oxygen. We're going to definitely need more. Okay, move some stuff over. There we go. There we go. Oh, that one too. And multi-tool. We like to check the multi-tool because you never know when there might be something in there you can use. And let's go ahead and put stuff in it. Did we pass the planet? Oh, okay, there we go. I've had that happen to me before. You pass right past it and you're like, oh, crap. Oh, look, it found, a, it found a base. Big surprise. Thank you, fish. And give me the chime. There we go. Okay, and we're done with that one. And we want to go there. Head towards the base. It's just easier. Okay. So 
so you're all set up. I do need to fix a couple spots on it, which we can clear out. There's usually two, and we don't have enough dihydrogen, so we're going to have to wait. All right. That down here. That goes here. Where's my batteries at? I'm going to move them down here, too. Gold is going to go in my other inventory. Got a decent amount of carbon condensed carbon to start with. We're going to need more oxygen. I know that for a fact, so. Alright, where's the space station? I should have been looking. Oh, there it is. Not quite as early as I want to the space station, but that's okay. Alright, looks like it is like this. Or like this. I don't, I can't tell. I'm going to have to get closer. All right, let's go to the space station. We'll hit the asteroids when we get out. They're back there and bottom to the left, but that's okay. We don't really need them right away. It's the uh, salvage data that we needed, so. Okay, it's a good spot. Okay, just kindly remember the things we need. So we got one word already. So this is number two. Okay, three. Okay, four. Already visited you. Five. One coming towards me, he'll be six. There we go. And he's seven. We're going to hit him while we're here, so we don't mess that up this time, right? And one, two, three, four, five. Okay, good. Got him. Oh, already got him. This is eight. We didn't hit the Gek, but that's okay. I think the guy over there we haven't talked talk to yet either, so this is nine. All right, so we got nine words. Okay, hit the terminal and sell. Sell, sell, sell. One less. I'm going to hang on to the iridescite because I have a funny feeling I can turn it into silver. Uh, we don't really have anything else we can sell. Uh, except some of the gold, and I'm not going to get rid of that. I'm going to go to Starship Inventory and then go to Buy. One, two, three, four, five, because we'll go to my Starship. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. Uh, let's see, in all these. There we go. Done. Who do we got? Anybody here still? No. Okay, we need Pugnium. Let's go to the other terminal. We can get it from the pilot, but the pilots aren't landing right now. Okay, all the way down to the bottom. And I'm going to check it for silver. I don't think there's any in here. We don't really need it, but... Oh, that's what I need. Let's get about ten of that. Now we're in good shape. But we need silver. we got to remember to get some, some silver. A little extra copper doesn't hurt anybody. Hey, buddy. Thank you for showing up. What do you got for me? Besides a whole lot of words. Chromatic metal, dirty bronze. Doesn't that give us something? I want to say yes, and I hate to buy it and find out I was wrong. Let me and I think... Ugh. You know I'm going to look real quick, because I had it open just a second ago, and of course an ad pops up on my screen. Look, let me and That's the building components that required it. Come on, get off the screen. There we go. Aronium and Herox and Dirty Bronze. So let's get some. Just one Dirty Bronze. That's all we need. Excellent. So we're good there. All right. Who else has landed in the meantime? Ah, went the wrong way. So we'll get some silver out of that. And Magnetized Ferrite, which we don't need. We'll get the Hermetic Seals. We just needed two. Okay, good. 
And one more guy over there. He's a fighter, so if he stays put long enough. Ionized cobalt is the next thing we need. Silver. Of course he has silver. Uh, I'm not going to get it because now we've got it. All right, we're good. Let's get out of here. Aronium. He had aronium too. Hmm. All right, so we need ionized cobalt. We'll get it later. We're in good shape. Right? 16 minutes. It's not terrible. Uh, I'm going to go down this way because it seems my... Actually, it's over that way is where it is. Let's do something here. Obviously, we need to move this over. Let's move that over too while we're at it. Starship. We don't need the minor settlement. What else did we find? We found the shelter. What did we find? I don't know. Observatory. This is why I got five of them. There it is. Trading post. Good deal. Good deal. This, I think, is the normal one. I'm going to have to remember where this one is so I can go there on a regular basis. There we go. All right. About 17 minutes is where we're landing. And if things go right, we should be able to get this done pretty quick. So I'm going to do the reload rather quickly. And I'm going to do that all. I'm going to put the base one place and I'm going to move it to another spot. And then I'm going to reload immediately. Okay, while we're here. Okay, we got that. Let's jump in and get our base computer. And we're going to put it pretty far away. We're going to put it over here. We got to do this, unfortunately. And if it if it happens to start working all of a sudden, we'll take it. Now, I like to jump out, uh, jump up to the platform, get my things, so maybe I'll do that first and just wait to see. Let me see about getting the Grand Tour. I think it's our nutrients processor. We do need to find if there is some wheat nearby. We've got a solar vine. I think there's some sweet root over here, so we can grab that. All right. Let's put this in our ship while I'm thinking of it. And we now have magnetized ferret. I think it just announced. Am I right? No? No, I thought it did. My bad. I thought it announced it. Okay. Still nothing, right? Alright, let's go ahead and... We're going to... Delete the base. So this is taking time, unfortunately. Is there anything I need to do while I'm waiting? Not really. Get rid of this. I don't need it anymore. Okay, we're going to put down the base computer one more time. Okay, try it again. Okay, we got to remember we got to take care of these guys. Okay, let's see if that worked. Give it a few seconds. Actually, it's jumping out of the ship real quick so we get the save point. Okay, here we go. Come on. Give it to me. Okay, so reload. Let's see if this works. Hopefully it does. Hopefully it does. We'll see what happens here. Last drink. It's just water. Calm down. So again, the clock's still clocking. Okay. Let's see if it works. If it does, I'll build the base right now. 
And I'm going to take a look around, see if I can't find any ship. No, not ship. Yes, it worked. Okay, that worked. So that's going to be my trick from now on. Alright, we got it. Let's build the base real fast. And I want to build it in such a way that it will work for me. As far as the main shelter is concerned, I shouldn't have done that. There we go. There we go. Door. Right there. Ramp. Two. Get our hazard protection. Health station. And over to here. Want some batteries. You know what? Let's do it. I don't care. Yeah, I did it again. Right there. We're going to put our solar panels in there and there. Okay. I think that's it, right? Storage containers. Yes, of course. Down here. There they are. One here. And I'm going to put the other one on top of it. Go here, and we're done with the base. All right. Excellent. What do we get from that? We get everything from that, right? We didn't do our asteroid yet, but that's okay. I'm not worried about it. Do it when we get back. Let's put them in our ship real quick. There we go. Let's make all the stuff that we need. Done. Okay. So let's head up to the platform and take a look. We're going to go to the lower one. Got it. Okay. What do you got for me, my friend? Cactus Fresh 160. Fecium. Excellent. We got what we need there. So we need 40 more. And if we can get to that guy, he might have the rest. Nope. <laughs> See? Like I said, it's random. Did the other guy have it? Ah. Eh. Don't go anywhere. Thank you. Yamaru, you have the same thing he does. That's weird. All right. So we got cactus flesh already. We got our hermetic seals. We don't need to hit that at this point. Nobody landing over here. All right. So remember, we've got our sweet root we need to get. How far away is that? That's a little, that's much further away, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, it is. While well, we're here, take another look. Oh, look, animals. One be all three of those. What's that? Pulpy root? Yeah, that's pulpy roots. Let's go in here. We'll rest up just a second. Okay. Oh, this would be so great if we can get everything in one shot, right? Nope. Uh, it's a shame. I was hoping to hit like four guys and get everything we needed, but you know, it's just asking too much right there. Gamma root. Hey, I almost bought it. Hey, get over here. Oh, for crying out loud. Walks through his ship. And you don't have what I need anyway. And you know, I should have put down some stuff. Should have put down my, uh... Uh... Refiner. Hey, you're right there. I'll take it. Uh, nope. The other guy's still there. Yes, he is. What do you got? Cactus flesh. Okay, good. Uh, I'm just going to get about 100 of it. There we go. Done. Thank you. So we got all our cactus flesh. We need fungal mold now. And we got somebody landing. How convenient. Hey, Neft, what do you got? Not what I'm looking for, Neft. I'm very disappointed in you. I already talked to you. Why haven't you left yet? Oh, okay. You just did. All right. So we're looking pretty good. Um, you know what? While we're here, let's just do it. We need... We don't have a lot in there. We'll get more in a little bit. We need that it turns into platinum you liar all right so i need to get that 
Let's put that back in my ship there. Oh, God, my, my inventory. And we're going to do you instead. Oh, the dirty bronze is what we need. My bad. My bad. Anybody else land? Looks like we had a couple other landers. Let's go over here. Silver. Uh, you know what? The dirty bronze. It was the dirty bronze I needed to do, and it is in my inventory, so I'm not going to buy it. It'll be expensive, and I need to save it for this. Okay, why is nobody carrying fungal mold today? So did you? What do you got? Fungal mold. Thank you. 184. We need 16 fungal mold. Why couldn't you carry 200? Be nice of you. Not happy there. Okay, you got another guy up there. Uh, hurry, 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 hurry. There we go. Fungal mold. I need 16. You got it for me? You've got it for me, my friend. Excellent. We're just going to go up here. That's enough. I could have grabbed the silver. I know. Hey, we're done. Let's pick you up. What do we got? 400 dihydrogen. I hope that's enough, right? And it was the dirty bronze that I needed to do. There it is. All right. We got it. Take you with me. Okay, next. So we want to hit the sweet root first and hope that we can find. Okay. Heptaloid wheat, but we may not be able to find it. That's our next spot. And we're going to be fighting. Ow. Ow. Broke my ankles. We're good. We're good. Everybody's fine. Rub some dirt in it. I'll walk it off. Come on. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. Okay, we're good. Carry on. Got a bunch of sodium. That's very nice. There we go. There we go. Now we're cooking with uh, something anyway. Rocket fuel. <laughs> ah, yes. Six, seven, and that should be good. Get the bolt caster. Oh, not you. Where's the other one? There you are. Thank you. Okay, we're done there. Heptaloid weed. Do we have any around? Let's take a look the other direction just in case. Because you never know. Oh, what's that? Solar vine, of course. When I need solar vine, I can't find solar vine. See? Look at that. Look at all the solar vine. Fireberries. Yeah, great. Thanks, man. Oh, there was an animal up there. And let's fall down and break my ankle. There you are. Okay. It's two animals, I believe. I think we need one more. Yep, we do. Let's just get over this thing here. All right. Too much stuff in the way. There we go. Okay, we're, we're looking better now. And there's our third animal. And just because. There we go. Okay, moving on. We got our 12 species. Ow, and a broken ankle again. All right, we're doing pretty good. We're at the 30-minute mark now. We got our base completed. We need to fight off some sentinels. We do need heptaloid wheat, which we haven't gotten it yet. Not sure why. Hey, while you're here, I don't like you. And where's the other guy? Got him. Okay. And I am going to face this way while they appear. Where'd they go? They should be over there. Where'd they go? Ah, okay. That's two, right? No, three, four. That's four. 
That's five, and this is six. Okay, we're up to six. We're gonna see if we can count them. Seven. I almost thought that was a sentinel. <laughs> That's eight. Who's next? There's nine. Ten. Oh, hi there. Eleven and twelve and thirteen are right here. It's twelve. Where's thirteen at? That's thirteen. Fourteen. Uh, that's 13. This is 14. Where'd the other guy go? There he is. 15. 16. Where'd the other guy go? He was just there. There he is. Ow. 17. Anybody else? Anybody else? 18. 19. I didn't kill him. Okay, this is 20. Twenty-one. Really didn't want to get the dog involved. Twenty-two. Twenty-three. I want to say it's 23. Let's double check. I didn't know. 24. 24 we're up to. Let's get over here and take one more out. 25. We're done. Phew. All right. How'd we do? I'm going to go ahead and get rid of that. We don't need it. Uh, weapon shard. We'll sell it. I'll use that. Use that. I'll take another one. That's fine by me. Good. And good. Okay, we're good. Excellent. Alright. Do we need to do anything else while we're here? I don't think so. And done. Okay, let's check in here. So, we need to warp to a new system. We can't. We can be... Repair our systems real quick. Let me do that. Uh, we've already got everything. We needed copper to do that, and I do need to fix that. That won't let me fix it for some reason. Let's go over here. Okay. I got the dihydrogen now. And I'm not worried about that. Okay. Oh, you know what? It says we're too far away. Okay. Now we should be able to repair it. There we go. Done. And we need to get any of the expedition rewards. Let's see. So scavenger we do need. We do need the sodium. And I am going to hold off on doing that. I'm going to wait till the backpack refiner if it'll get off my screen. There we go. All right, what do we got? We need the we need the asteroids. Let's go ahead and do that. We can't build the wonder projector yet because we haven't well, destroyed the asteroids yet. Uh, do we need that? We need the carbon. Okay. Uh, let's see. What about this one? Do we need that? No. And yes, definitely. Okay, good. So we just need to blast some asteroids before we leave. Alright, we're good here. All right, where is our space station at? It is right over here. We're going to head in that direction, but... Oh, there it is. Right down there. Okay, good. Let's take out some asteroids, and then we'll head out of the system. Okay. Love to be able to keep track of how many asteroids I'm doing, but honestly, I mean, who can keep track of it? 
There's some people out there that can. I know I am not one of them. So let's be clear about that. Just checking around me, making sure I'm not being snuck up on by a kid. Of course, at this point, even if I accidentally hit the station, I should be able to get out of here pretty quick. Can't use your hyperdrive while you're being attacked, though, so you got to be careful anyway. So i got to remember that. Grab some dirty bronze is a very good idea to grab in your space station if you can find a pilot with it. Yep. Don't want to shoot the space station. Or a pilot heading for the space station. That would suck too. There we go. And so we have our hyperdrive. We've got everything ready to go. Let's get out of here, shall we? First thing we're going to do is go to a pirate system. Which is right there. Go there, and we're done with that one. We'll get that out of the way. 37, not too shabby. Not too shabby. Again, we, haven't, we haven't done the Wonder Projector or the Nutrient Processor. We still need the Heptaloid Wheat. We haven't been fortunate in finding that. On, uh, I seem to recall there was a planet where there was Heptaloid Wheat, wheat like right next to the Rendezvous. So, And I just don't remember where that was. I'll see if I can't recall that later. Get off the screen. I can't see. Thank you. On our way. There we go. And we're going in. Okay. Any other things that we need to get while we're here? We've done the interstellar. Launch fuel. Yeah, we need that movement and system upgrade. Okay, let's go over here real quick, and we're going to move some stuff around. Actually, that's okay. No, put it over here. Humboldt Drive. We have filled up our inventory over here, haven't we? Um, hold on a second here. That is what I'm looking for. And, and here, we're going to do this real fast and uninstall it. Okay, good. Let's go. You know what? While we're here, and sell. Scanner, mining beam, I don't really need it. Sentinel weapon shard, exosuit, unbolt. Look at that. We've got 4,000. Yikes. 4,000 nanite. I don't know why I was searching that. I got something out of it. That's funny. Um, sell. We need to get rid of the bromide salt. You don't want to sell the wrong things. Let's go ahead and get rid of the Ticket to Freedom. We don't need it anymore. And the landing pad. Um, the Iridocyte, we don't need that either. Um, let's see. Oh, there's the bones. Okay, good. All right. That's funny. Um, let's go ahead and grab all five of these. Uh, we'll grab a little more dihydrogen. Why not? And is there anything else in here we can use? Nope, we're good. Get out of here. Out. Outy. Gone. And we're going to go to that system right there. And hit the space station. And we get our first hyperdrive upgrade there. Because if we don't get the hyperdrive upgrade here, we're not going to get it. Now, we got our asteroid, so I should, I should claim that reward as we pull into the space station. Because we're going to need the nutrient processor. We'll do that at the first rendezvous. If we can find the heptaloid wheat. There it is, down there. In we go. Let's get that while we're doing it. Okay. All 
right. We need to go to this side. And only this side. There's nothing we can do on the other side. I'm not going to worry about it. While we're here, grab you. One. Uh, we need one more pulse engine. And, hey, okay, while we're at it, uh, let's get rid of the trade rocket. There we go. And the hyperdrive. There we go. Let's go ahead and install that and uninstall it. Now we don't need to buy that anymore. Let's put this in our... Um, yeah. And where is it? Oh, we need to sell that to the terminal. So we've got to remember to do that. Where was the other thing? It must be over here. Oh, there it is. All right, we're good. Let's go. All right, what do we got? First sell. Where is it? Where is it? Done. Buy. We could use a little more copper, so I'm going to grab it anyway. I always say I'm going to do that. We got the silver now, so... And there's our ionized cobalt. We need 100. And anything else? No and no. We're all, we're all good. Let's get out of here. Okay. Heptaloid weed. Yeah, I think we got everything now. We just need the heptaloid weed, and that's it. Right there. All right, so this is going to be rendezvous one. I want to be at the dissonant planet at like the 55 minute mark. I don't know if I can do it, but can we do it in 13 minutes? 12 minutes? I don't know. We'll see. Because we're going to do the fallen uh, freighter here. Uh, let's see. Back to one. Rendezvous one. Uh, let me just check. There's a new reward here. Do we need that? No. We need this. And we already decided no. Okay, we're there. Good. And where'd it go? There it is. Right there. On our way. And we're definitely not lined up. <laughs> As we expected. Alright. Um, let's charge some stuff up. Tritium, tritium. Okay. How's our launch fuel look? Good. Oh, we got two more of those, huh? That's nice. I don't want to use up the condensed carbon. We're definitely going to need more of it. Separate that now. Here, let's do this. Okay. Move that into my ship. That goes into the ship. That goes into the ship. We'll put that in the ship, too. And hey, why not? We'll put you there, too, along with you. And the silver. Sodium. Yep, we need to do that. those two guys. Plenty of dihydrogen now, right? Hmm, wonderful. Where's our ferrite dust? Oh, there it is. Okay, I'll take that back. Uh, anything else? No? There we go. Spin around, because apparently we are locked onto a base again. Thank you, everybody who puts bases on these planets. I don't really, I'm not really mad at them too much. I know you want to be, like, part of it, and it, it's understandable. You know, everybody wants to be part of the show, so to speak, in the, in regards to having your base nearby, the rendezvous, that everybody's going to be seeing it. And I get it. I do get it. But boy, it drives us nuts. <laughs> there we go. Dropping in. 45. And we'd be out of here at the 50-minute mark. Who knows? I'm going to put this down and get in, and actually, we're going to process this, and I'm going to, wow, we only need 26 of it, so, there we go, go, and while we're doing that, we'll get our rendezvous stated, talk to this guy, we need his solar mirror, thank you, we're going to go back in and get his advanced mining laser. Nope. Did it again. Gosh darn it all. I keep doing that. There we go. All right. And multi-tool. And we're going to put the mining laser in. There you go. 
Done, then done. You. Pulling you out. And there was one more thing we needed to do, wasn't there? Where's the carbon at? 273, where's the 272? 232, that'll work. Go. And we'll get some condensed carbon while we're waiting on that. Let's jump over here. Scan. Right there. Scan. Scan. Done. Actually, and we'll do the sodium in a little bit here. Let's go ahead and get to the Nautilin. Again, I'm going to take off and go over here. You could also get some words there. If you talk to some of the people that are around, the traders and stuff like that, you can find some words. I think we're far enough from anybody's space right here. And if I seem to recall something here... All right, we need that and that. And I did the scan real quick because sometimes there's some condensed carbon here. Okay, Exocraft. That. There. Okay, multi tool. No, Exocraft. Finish it. Uh, we got some dihydrogen over there, but I don't see anything else. Okay. Into the ship. On our way. And it should be the same greater that we've been finding every single time. Uh, how far away is that? 39. Okay, we need to go up a little bit higher and take a little bit of a dive down. If I can get my ship to respond to my mouse. I love when the clock starts clocking upwards. It's like, hey, wait a second here. It should be the same one we found last time, though. It should be an island to the left. Maybe not. Maybe it is a different one. Ah, good. It's sticking up just above the water. Look at that. Did we get fortunate or what? This will be quicker. We'll be out of here in a minute. There we go. Get close enough to hit it. There we go. Not reading anything. Too bad. See how fast we can get through this. Come on. Yes, I know. Yep, we know. All right, we're good. Uh, which side? Let's go to this side. So we're going to head to the anomaly at this point. See if we can get the anomaly done in about five minutes. It'd be kind of cool. Or less, actually. Come on, come on, come on, out of the water. Thank you. Good. 50 minute mark. Good. Okay. In we go. There we go. Okay. What can we do here? Anything? No? Nothing? Get rid of that. We don't need it. Actually, I don't need that either. How are we doing on the... Yep, we're doing okay there. We're going to need to recharge that. That is here. And that. Okay, out of the ship. And go. Well, we got the achievements popping up on our screen any second. And up. 
we go. Okay. Jeez. Timing. Timing was terrible on that. Okay, go over here. Don't need to talk to you anymore. Good. What do you think? I can like the 53 minute mark personally. Okay, you. And that. Nope. Oh, 5,000 nanites in my inventory. Cut that out. I already got that. Go over here. We're going to build them backpack refiner here in just a minute. We want to get this done. I've already got all the stuff. I just got to hit Helios. Hold on. It's not registering. There we go. And I don't care what he gives me, so I'm just going to decline this time. Okay, we're done with those two. Trying to take as many shortcuts as I can here. Come on. If it'll let me. There we go. 53, huh? No, I don't think we're getting out of here 53. Maybe 54. We'll hit the last terminus at 53 anyway. Okay, that is done at the 53 minute mark. Talk to you. And we don't have a choice. We have to do this. Okay, done. All five sentences are complete. Let's go to our... Yep. 53 and a half. Not too shabby. So the anomaly we should finish around the 56 minute mark, give or take. And we're gone. Alright, what do we got? Anything that we need to install? You know, I need to get rid of you. We can get rid of you. Okay. So, we're off to the Atlas Station. There we go. That way. There. Hyperdrive has no fuel. Of course it doesn't. Did I get my fuel for it? Yes, I did. There we go. On our way. All right. So we'll hit that 55-minute mark. Go if we'd be out of there on the 56, and we'll get to the planet before the one hour. That is the goal. Now i got to put my backpack refiner in. We're going to do that as we enter the Atlas station. And then we're going to start getting the sodium taken care of, because we need sodium nitrate. Boom. Boom, boom. Got some extra stuff out of that. That's great. Come on. Alright, so what do we got? Let's get in here. Exosuit. Build a backpack refiner. And we need more oxygen. Go figure, right? So I'm going to go ahead and uninstall this. Will this help? Let me find out, right? Where's the oxygen at? Ugh. It didn't give us more oxygen, so we're going to need to use this one. And it still isn't enough oxygen. We need 150. Well, crud. So I can't refine anything. Unbelievable. Go over here first, get our word. So we'll figure this out. Trying to think what can give us oxygen. We'll have to check out what our upgrades are going to be like. So I really thought we had enough oxygen. Another setback. It's amazing sometimes what happens. 
That's on me, though. I needed more oxygen. But whatever happens, this is my last run, and I'm going to post these anyway. Eventually. We'll get there. I promise. Okay. Nope, wrong one. Okay, now let's take a look. See if we have any heptaloid weed anywhere. Nope, of course it has everything else but what I'm looking for. So we'll have to wait again. So we need oxygen. What can we put in here to make oxygen? Let me try something real quick. I want one item I can think of. Nope, gives us carbon. And you? Also carbon. Not surprising. Deuterium? No? Okay. Sometimes it does, so I just wanted to make sure. And we need the salt. We gotta keep that. How convenient. Okay. Let's take that and go with it. Let's see if that's enough. I hope it is, otherwise we gotta find oxygen. Let me just do something real quick. Is that literally right there? It is. That's gonna hurt. Okay. There's one more plant over here. We'll grab it. How much do we have? We have enough. So if we have to, we're in good shape. Alright, let's get out of here. So that only took us a moment. Not quite enough time to really hopefully make any difference, but we'll see, right? All right, and I'm not going to pulse drive out because I need to take a look around. Okay, so there's the Atlas station. Everything we need should be in that general direction. There it is. Okay. First things first, we need to get our rewards. So, do we need anything from here? No. We already got all that. Two. We definitely need that. Okay, and while we're in here, let's add that in. And I'm just going to move some things around only because we need to make room. Okay, so, memory. While we're here, might as well do it, right? Okay, so we got the memory. Is there anything else we need? Real quick. Three. No. Four. Yes. Real quick. Four. No. Oxygen upgrades probably would have given the oxygen I needed. And I don't need that. Okay, good. Back to here. So we're going to have to witness a memory. Ready? Let's do it. Okay, we go in here. Hit it. So we're at the about one hour mark already. Unfortunately, I was hoping to get to the planet before then, but we'll see. Okay. There we go. Okay, we go over here, and in we go. Good, we have enough to build it. Let's go. Oh, that was rude. Fool me. Okay. 
I'm going to do the same thing here. Okay. Four. Good. We're going to use that. Actually, we need that too. There. Eh, move it over. And last one. Ah, good. We have enough. Imagine being on the planet looking up and seeing that thing looking back at you. That would be freaky. Okay. And is that this one? Okay, no, we're done, actually. So that was the final memory. Okay, so we're done. We need to just do... Ah, you doofus. Come on. That. And we're not lined up on it. It's like a different one every time, right? Okay. In we go. No storms at the moment. And I, hopefully we'll get fortunate enough that we'll have um, some radiant shards nearby. Looks like there's a landing platform nearby too. Yeah, looks like we got a few. Two right there and there's one on the to my left. One. We need three of them. Two. And there was one over here, wasn't there? Yeah, right there. And it looks like we got a storm coming in, don't we? Nope, nope, no storm. Okay, take a quick look. We need a mirror. Nope. 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 And some heptaloid weed if we have any. Sweet root. Go figure. Pulpy. Yep, I know. You all stink. Oh, wait. You got two guys over there. There's corrupted drones. Why are there corrupted drones and no thing? That's interesting. Keep an eye open for the heptaloid weed. That's all I can say. Because that's the one thing that's going to hold us back. Okay, what do we got? You, 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 okay. Right there. And it's close enough by that we can go there. And then we'll take another look. Yeah, well, let's just go ahead and do it because it's not going to let us do anything otherwise. Hi there. Wow, you're close. You know what? Let's take another close look at it. Should tell us what it's got. Doesn't tell us for some reason. Inverted mirror. Excellent. We're going to go this way. And then this way. And then this way. This way. Zigzag, zigzag, zigzag. Got it. Yes. All right. They had just popped up but hadn't found me yet. Uh, no, we're not going into there. We want to go in here. And we're going to use... We're going to, we need to find some heptaloid wheat, so... Exosuit. Hit the scan. Up we go. Where is it? This way. The other side of this volcano. Good. Not far. Still no storms. That's a good thing. And we need to find if we have heptaloid wheat nearby. No. That means we got a storm coming in, I think. No. Take a look real quick. Because I need that heptaloid wheat something bad. There it is. What's that? Sweet root again. You jerk. Yeah, 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 I know. No heptaloid wheat. Wow. Okay. We do have a storm coming in. Okay, let's go. Yeah, 
this one. And back to this one. All right. So we're going to check at the first rendezvous, or second, second rendezvous, pardon me. There we go. My bad. Back the other way, around the volcano. Yep, don't care. As long as it's not one of those big, big rocks. Down you go. Alright, so this guy's done. 106, it's not terrible. Okay. Pair. No, it's an A class. Nice. Too bad we're not keeping it. Alright. Jump in here real quick and just take a look. So one is complete. Two, we're going to be going to the rendezvous. We do have to expand our base. We're going to go through the black hole, expand our base. We're not going to be able to do the um, biscuits yet until we can get that heptaloid wheat. But we've got everything else, so we're in good shape. We can do a wonder projector while we're there. So we've got to remember to do that while we're there. Okay. Here we go. Okay. Out. So we want to go to a black hole. And Hovel, Hovel Pie, which has also been renamed Poland, is where we're going. Whew. 6.45 p.m. here while I'm doing this. So this will be my last run. Because we, I've got some other videos to do tonight, some family videos, so I'm looking forward to them. Hey, you ever seen someone do that in hyperspace? I think I just messed it up. <laughs> there we go. Boost my engines. Let's get through this. There we go. Okay, and we can do it in hyperspace too. Watch this. Only can, you can only do it with certain ships. You can't do it with Sentinel ships. You can do it with solar ships, though, definitely. They look pretty when you do it. There we go. Three times. All right, we're done. Enough fun. 108. It's probably a little less than that because of the fact that we had to reload that one time, so... Oop. Turned instead of going to the space station. I don't know why that happened, but there we go. Yep, I know. We traveled a long way. Alright, so that's done. And we should have the glass on us, right? We got glass somewhere on us? We don't have glass on us. We never did the glass. Okay, we're going to do that now. There we go. Get that going. Okay, we're out. Okay, back to our... Hold on. Hi, guy. Talk. How about you? Real quick? This should be the two we need. There we go. We're all done. Base. Go. Nice. So that gets our languages language taken care of. Figured I'd do it while they're standing right there. We could have got it at the Atlas and jumped out, and it, but now it's out of the way. We don't have to worry about it. One less milestone to worry about. And I can't flip in the portal. Okay. All right, so here... Angled windows. Let's see if we have enough to do this with, shall we? Two, three. It didn't make it. Why? What are we missing? Stop. Get off my screen. I can't see what's happening. Oh, the glass. Duh. <laughs> Still making it. Okay, we'll take it out. Let's put the angled windows in. One, two, three. Okay, while we're waiting, 
We can't do the glass through corridors yet because we don't have enough. Let's do the table. The octa cabinet. We're going to do the... Oh, wonder projector. Let's go ahead and put them, them down. Let's do the screens. Got to be the blue ones. One, two, three. And then we want to do the light right here. That's good. Oh, great. Nice glitching there. And we're going to go back into our inventory and we're going to pull out some more glass. Almost done. And we're going to do the glass roofed corridors, right? One, two, three. All done. And we don't have enough to do. Oh, we do have enough. Okay, good. And they're up. Is that everything? It is. We're done. Okay. And we did that. Okay, so one is complete, two is complete, except the rendezvous. Three is complete, except the rendezvous. Four is almost complete. We still have to bake biscuits. We, we can't get the wheat for some stupid reason. We'll wait until we get to two and see if we can't find it. And five, we're really rolling along. Okay, good. Two we go. Here we go. Number two. Out of here. All right. Hyperspace. We haven't run out of hyperjuice yet? No. Not the Galactic Center. Where in the world is my expedition? There we go. Going the way wrong way, wasn't I? Good thing that that didn't count. This is it. I have a good feeling about this one. I'm not sure if we're going to complete it before the 130 mark, but boy, it's going to be close. We have nothing else heavy, heavy to do except for the biscuit. And I have to be able to get heptaloid wheat to do that. So two is close by. It is right there. Oh, let's line up right for once. We're not quite lined up, but that's okay. Looks like we locked on right just to the one side. That's fine. This one is a portal, so hopefully we have some haptaloid wheat nearby. Good test. Be nice to know, wouldn't it? All right, let's take a look. Where are you? There it is. Okay. And I'm going to look for it here. This is probably the nicest planet to do it on. It, it does have some storms on occasion. Sweet root, of course. And is there a rock somewhere nearby I can scan? There's a rock. And we need animals. There you go. I'll take you. And now let's look for the heptaloid wheat. All right. We are not finding it at this point. Let's head towards the sweet root. And maybe we'll get fortunate. We're going to waste some time, unfortunately, but we got to find this. Yeah, it's not going to show it to us from the ground, unfortunately. So we actually are going to have to land. And look on foot. Un stinks, but there you are. All right. So, Heptaloid, the... the Sweet root is right here. There is nothing else near it, correct? Impulse beans, of course. There'll be a ton of those everywhere, but I do not see any heptaloid wheat. All right, we've recharged the unit. Let's go ahead and head down here. That should be good. Let's take a look. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? What are you? Pulpy, of course. Pulpy. Impulse. That's probably in the same. Okay, let's head out. Maybe we can't boost our scanner. Guess I shouldn't have thrown all those things away, right? What are you? 
Heptaloid weed. Okay, let's head over there and we'll pull in our ship. So again, this is how speedruns fail. And now you know. Now as we complete the others, we will... We will check the sites and see if there's any heptaloid weed nearby. But we can't do this on our person, right? Kind of a backpack nutrient uh, unit. Uh, where are you there? There we go. Dough. And we're just going to do cactus. Gone. Got it. Okay, let's get out of here. Gone. Expedition is this way. Good. We're on to number three. Now, as you know about last time, it took us about 10 to 12 minutes to complete the rest of these. Three, four, and five. As well as hitting the Atlas. So we could end up under still under 130 on this. It's not my fastest time, so I'm a little bit heaved. But we'll see. We'll see. I just, I really, if I can just, if I can hit 59 minutes. 59, that's all I want. I don't have to be the fastest. Get off my screen, thank you. Gotcha. I think we're locked in for once. Alright, what can we get rid of? Let's get rid of these. We don't need them. We don't really need that. I'll keep it in there in case we decide we want something. Let's get rid of the Mordite. We don't need it anymore. What do we got over here? I always open those up, but it's always the same kind of baloney. Yeah, I could have used you earlier, right? Plasma launcher, you're right. I don't care. I'm gonna get rid of you. Pulse engine, I'll go ahead and throw you in here. It's always nice. We don't need you anymore. We don't need you anymore. Open you up. I don't even know what you gave me. Okay. Didn't seem to need as much glass as I thought we would need. But it is what it is. Alright, that's not too bad. It came up on a base right there, but that's okay. We're going to go ahead and hit the freighter over here. That's not too shabby. It'll disappear in a second. Love when that happens. Nice graphical issue there. And there we are. We have our upgrade in our exosuit. Yes, we do. And that means we can jetpack all the way to the edge. And if you're wondering why I keep doing this, I keep coming over here specifically, is because there's literally no animals will appear anywhere else. So we just I just do it over here. And you just kind of hope you can slam onto the plant life there and that the these bugs show up or these creatures show up soon enough. And they did this time. So we got out of here a lot quicker. There we go. We're gone. Okay, where to? We're going on to number four, I think. This way. Yeah, it looks like it. Yep, let's go. So this will be four. I mean, we're definitely a little quicker than we were last time. I just, I'm so ticked off that I couldn't get heptolite weed on the first planet. If we had done that, that would have been fantastic. And we would have had that completed already. And we'd probably be at least a minute sooner at this point. But it is what it is. Here we go. We just need to get out of this and get over here. So three is complete, right? Four. We need to go to the rendezvous. To the right. Ugh, it's not the button I was trying to hit. There you go. I think we're locked in this time. Nice. Nice if I don't have to keep readjusting everything. Okay, we got cadmium. We don't think we need it anymore. How are we doing on charges? I'm going to go ahead and put it in now. Yeah, why not? Pulse engine's doing good. 
How's my exosuit doing? We're doing alright there? Yes, we are. We don't need that anymore. Okay, good. Good, good, good. How we doing? Well, we didn't quite get where we were supposed to be going, but close enough. Close enough. So this is going to be another portal. And since this is number four, we got to remember to get our um, other guy here. Where is it? There it is. Get the Ronde the Fallen is what we need here. So we're going to take a look around, right? The the freighter, you're not going to find any plants nearby, so there's no use in taking a look. But we will take a look here real quick. Rendezvous 4 is complete. I'm going to scan this rock because it's right there. And why not? You guys are there too. And is there a plant nearby? I can just get onto the... Right there. Okay. Impulse beans. Impulse beans. Just to take a quick look, we know the star stuff is over there, too. Uh, I need you. Okay, so I don't see any heptaloid wheat nearby, so. So, that, I can't seem to get in. There we go. Okay. I'll go over here and get the fallen. There we go. Sometimes you got to do that. Sometimes you get rid of these bases. People put bases on top of this crap, and it's so annoying. That this is just stupid. I'm sorry. If you're if you're the idiot that built that base, would you please remove it? I'm tired of reporting it. Uh, we need to go in here. We need to get fallen and put it in. There we go. Okay. And we should be in high, in space. Good. Okay, we're going on to the next one. That's over here. On our way. You're welcome. <laughs> Had to do it again. I know it seems to delay it, though, as you're trying to come out, so I'm not going to do it again. All right, so this comes to number five, and then we're going to go to the Atlas. Okay, so we want to do that. So we got the blue star, it's about to pop. We got to go to the Atlas after this. If we can line up just right. Because to me, it's worth it to just, if you can get lined up, I don't think we are again. If you can get lined up, it's even better. So we'll see what happens here. It's gotten dark, most of the day is gone. It sounds like this. First lyrics to a country song. I don't know why. Here we go. Coming in. Watch out for those towers. Yay, more messages. Um, yeah, storm again, so I can't see a blessed thing. Is that it? Yes, it is. Okay, good. Almost landed right on top of it. Almost. Wasn't trying to. Okay, scan a plant. Right, plant, plant. There's the rock up here someplace, if I can find it. There it is. And where's our flighted birds somewhere? Lighted birds. Where are birds? There's no birds. There we go. Get him. And real quick, any heptaloid weed anywhere. So I can confirm that there doesn't seem to be any heptaloid weed in the galaxy. Hexaberry. Yeah, I knew that was there. Okay. Oh, one more. Healthy roots. Okay, we're done. 
Yeah, that's alright, we're gone. Don't worry about it. So where are we going? We are going to the Atlas. Okay. Off we go. Atlas. That's the path. And this is where we're going. What's our time? 126. So we should get to the planet before 130. That's what I'm hoping for. Got my mother texting me. Talking about... I'm going to share it. It's, it's perfectly fine. Why not? I just saw a newscast about kids getting 30% re better reading skills when they read to a dog. You know what's interesting about that? That your tax dollars in the United States went to paying for somebody to do a study on children reading to dogs. I don't know what to say. All right. Already got our words. We just got to talk to this guy. Well, no. We got to talk at this guy. He's not actually going to talk back. And onwards. That moon walked away from him. That was freaking awesome. And up we go. And we're in. We're out of this place. Hopefully in another minute or so, we will have our anomalous animal and we can shut this down. Okay. Let's go over here. I don't think the extra second is going to make a difference at this point. Okay, down we go, straight at the planet. I'm not even bothering with finding a spot. Oh, yeah, I don't really want to be in a hole, though. Good God. Bet you this hexa. Bet you there's some weed on this planet. Okay, take a look. Get rid of that stuff off my screen. Oh, look at that. Unbelievable. Okay. Animals, animals, animals. Just looking for red dots. We need some red dots. There's one. Nobody else? Okay, we're going to head over there because, unfortunately, it's at the top of the other hill. Right behind this. And done. Ship is over here. We're in. Oh, come on, I was in. Out. Stop. Stop the clock. We have completed everything. Everything is complete. And how long ago? Ten seconds. I did record that one. Okay, we're out. And without further ado, let's hope we got... I'm hoping for like 102 at this point. <laughs> oh, damn it. All right, 102 it is. I, if I didn't have to look for the heptaloid wheat, it might have saved me a minute. So I need to work on getting off the home planet faster and possibly getting through the Sentinel battle quicker. I'm not sure how to do that. We're going to try it next time on my next video that you see uh, with the, uh, we're going to get the asteroids and everything else like that before we hit the planet. And we're going to see if we can get our um, mech and we can jump inside the mech and we'll see if we can do it quicker with that. I don't know if it'll be possible, but we'll try. I've seen Jason do it. I'm going to give it a shot. Well, folks, thank you again for watching. Please hit the like and subscribe. I know this is a long video, but I hope you enjoyed it. A lot of what not to do and how not to make mistakes, I guess, if you can get around the mistakes that I made. So we'll see you again in the next video. Take care, everybody.